Hello everyone, welcome to what is probably going to be the final stream of uh, Pokemon Sword. I think so. I think, like, I was like, do I title this me finishing the game? And I was like, I'm so close to the end of the game. Like, I think I can. So I've got all of the, the gym badges uh, for those that haven't been kind of watching the, the whole time. So I've defeated all of the, the gyms. I just have, like, the, the final challenge to do. I just don't know if there's going to be any, like extra story stuff there's been all of these uh these things going through about this legend of these you know two pokemon and these heroes and stuff so there's probably going to be some uh payoff for for that uh, anyway hello everyone ah that beard says micah <laughs> uh do max raid battles uh i'm pretty good at just play through the story today uh, i'll probably end up I'm battling some of you, uh, something that I've been doing a lot in these streams is kind of uh, battling against viewers and that's just always been really, really fun. So um, yeah, I'll probably do that a little bit later on. Oh, squid streaming. Battle squid. I saw, how long was he, he was, I saw he was streaming like hours ago. He's been streaming for a long time. Uh, yeah, uh, if squid is still streaming now, uh, feel free to to extend a, uh, a challenge hand to, to his chat to see whether he wants to uh, to give me a battle uh, a little bit later on uh, if he's uh, if he's still going. Uh, yeah, hope everyone's having a, a good weekend. We just went out and got our um, our Christmas tree today. Starting to get a, a little bit more festive uh, around here. Oh, should put my uh, should put my hat on. Uh, Squid has been streaming for two hours so far. Uh, thanks for the uh, donation, Gamer King. Thanks for joining us in the the stream uh yeah let's uh let's play the game so i just arrived in so it's basically london but they called it winden uh for those that have been watching them all and um want to like uh keep track so uh, i ended the last episode here i think at the beginning of route 10 i made my way up here oh oh i tell you what i tell you something that happened i filmed it i filmed it for you right um i captured so i captured Oh no, is that the right one? Yeah. So I, I This is uh this happened yesterday. <laughs> yeah, so I, I caught a Mr. Mine. I haven't named Mr. Mine yet, so I am gonna need some suggestions for, for names. Uh, I couldn't record the moment. So he has uh, has replaced Gary. I probably don't need a Mr. Mine, because he's like ice psychic and I already have psych psychic Pokemon because we can learn ice. But just the way he's dancing like that, I had to capture him. <laughs> uh, game time. Oh, it is loud, isn't it? <laughs> right, let's uh, let's turn that way down. I think that was maybe from like a gym battle. Uh, and then yeah, then almost immediately, and I was kind of annoyed that it didn't happen in stream. Mr. Mime evolved into to Mr. Rhyme. Game audio too loud. You can't hear me. It should be okay now. Hopefully. I don't know why it was like left that loud. Turn it down a bit. Oh, much better. Yeah, so now I got a Mr. Rhyme. Now this is one of my one of my Pokemon. And I couldn't be more happy. So we need a nickname for him. So when I go to the uh, the Pokemon Center now, uh, we're gonna go and give a uh, a nickname uh, to him. Right, game sound should be okay. Oh, there's a Pokemon Center right here. Right, yes, we need a nickname for not Mr. Mime, for Mr. Rhyme. That's who we need a a nickname for. So start doing your suggestions in the the chat. The uh, the best one we should do. So he's got a hat on. He's got like a um a face on his belly, and he's always tap tap dancing, and he's got a cane. So there's some of his characteristics that you might want to bear in mind uh, when you're um thinking of a of a nickname. Rapper rhyme, Mister Mister Lime Tappy. Uh, call him Dad. Uh, rhyme man, Tappy, Tapper. So I just said Battle Squiddy, Mr. Fazy, Joker, Tap Hat. I quite like Tap Hat. I might call him like, uh, like I might do it in like, you did it as two words. I might do it as like one. So it's like Tap Hat, like that. Like Tap Hat. There we go. That'll do. That'll do. This is now Tap Hat. Oh, hello, uh, Dog Woof. With your suggestion of Tappy. Sorry, I've gone with Tapat <laughs> already. Uh, actually, well, actually, we can buy potions and stuff there. So yeah, we got like the whole of a uh, the whole of London. This place, or like Winden, uh, I guess it's meant to be. Can I go in all of? The, are all these houses I can go in? Can I go in every one of these houses? I can't. There's like a million houses. 
Oh, hello. I think I picked the best one, though. I picked the best one first go. The truest evolution for Pokemon is, I believe, becoming part of a team as friend, blah, 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 blah. Okay. Very nice. So, yeah, I'm not going to go in all of these houses. Uh, Stampy, check messages. Oh, is Squid messaging me? Oh, he is. Are you wanting a, a battle, Squid says. Right, should we start off the stream with a, a battle against uh, against Squid then? Uh, right, let me just... Um... Oh, I'd have to swallow my headphones and stuff again. Right, is that what we want? Are we wanting battle with Squiddy Ty? Oh, everyone's saying yes. <laughs> everyone wants a battle with Squid. Right then. Last time, he defeated me. So I need to get revenge. Uh... I might just do it so we can't hear each other. So you're going to have to switch between streams. Right, we're going to do a single battle. Yeah, so we just so if you want to hear both sides, if you uh, get both streams and kind of pause and play it to, to line them up. Uh, you'll be able to see that. So yeah, we battled before. He won. I think I've got a, a better roster of Pokemon now than I did then. I still didn't have a, a great roster because I mainly go based on um how cute the Pokemon are. <laughs> rather than how good they actually are. So I need to send uh, Squid a code. That's why you can't see the, the game screen. Because I don't want you to be able to say, oh, oh he's he sent me a code. Right. So I should... Be about to get into a game with Squid Nugget. Oh, this is an exciting way to start it off. So he's been playing for two hours. He's all he's all warmed up and ready to, to battle. I'm going in cold. I'm going in fresh. <laughs> right, I'm going to keep uh, keep Facebook up so I can uh, see what he's saying. Uh, I'll decide the rules. Why do I get to decide? Like, he's the one who, like, set up the, uh, set up the, the thingy. All right, let me make it so I can see donations uh, as well. All right, then. Uh, normal battle. So all of the Pokemon are going to be set to, to level 50. So it's going to be fair in that way. Uh, so this is my, this is my, my winning roster. So a lot of, like, ghost and psychic Pokemon I've ended up with all at the, the same time. He's gonna, he's gonna love it when he sees my my Mr. Rhyme. I'm so proud of it. I don't. I think am I to those that have been uh, have been watching Squid. Who's further in the the game now? Has he overtaken me? I think he might have overtaken me. Or I think we're at least pretty close because we were pretty much at the same place last time we battled. But I think he might have uh, have maybe caught up with me a little bit. Uh, shout out to uh, Nathaniel uh, for the the, the donation uh, as well as uh, Matt uh, and Liz uh, as well, who's been watching since I started playing Minecraft. Thank you all so much. All uh, right, we need to choose an order. So the order doesn't matter. All that really matters is who's like the first one you send out. And then the uh, the rest you can always just switch around whenever you want anyway. I do now have my my fancy graph. So I got a um, uh, I got a graph which is uh, like uh, basically just showing like which Pokemon are effective against which other Pokemon. Oh, and he's decorated his picture now. <laughs> now he's got fancy. Yeah, and uh, that graph has been really, really helpful. And he kind of relies on people in the the chat, letting him uh, letting him know what's good against what. Of course, of course, he's he's starting off with a squid Pokemon. Is that like a fighting Pokemon as well? Ah, so none of these are uh, close combat's just pretty strong. I was kind of tempted to go straight in with a with a Dynamax. Yeah, can we have some? Uh, can can we all? Can everyone go over to uh, to Squid Stream? And just spam hashtag Team Stampy in his chat. <laughs> yeah, so don't support me with hashtag Team Stampy here. Just go over to his side and do hashtag Team Stampy for, for, in his chat. Because that will really annoy him. <laughs> A lot of people are watching both streams at the, the same time. Oh, and I get him with an early win. He was stronger than me, but I was faster. I had higher speed. Uh, I'm a potato. I was asking what happening, uh, what's happening. Uh, I'm battling against Iblistic Squid. He's streaming at the, the same time, if you want to watch his view. Oh, has he sent them all back? There's a lot of Team Squid coming up in my chat. Right, make sure there's more hashtag Team Stampy in his chat than there are Team Squid in mine. I might just block the word squid in chat. <laughs> and then no one can support him. 
Um... Guess I should go for close combat again. I don't know who's gonna have higher speed. What what um what elements is that Pokemon? Does anyone know? Like who should I switch to after this? Like it's flying, so maybe Alex would be good to switch to, but is it like steel or rock or something as well? It's flying steel. So what's good against steel? Because I'm assuming electric isn't. Oh, electric's neutral against it. Oh, so fire would be good. And fighting. Uh, oh, okay, it kind of shows me here what's effective. Aha, uh -huh. yeah, Alex. All right, let's bring out, let's bring out Alex. Thank you for all of the uh, the help, guys. I uh, the reason the stream was a little bit late to start was because I was going to make a cup of tea. Hope you don't mind. <laughs> right, I should be higher speed here. Alex is a uh, Alex is pretty speedy, despite growing up with short legs. I reckon he's panicking a bit here. I might be getting revenge here. Uh, bye, dog woof. Oh, he's in trouble. He's in trouble. All right, who's he bringing out next? He's going to bring out, is he going to bring out like a rock Pokemon or something to go against Alex? Or maybe I reckon he's going to bring out his queen, which is the name for, for like basically the same Pokemon as Alex, but that's his name for it. Oh, he's, pa he's taking ages. He's panicking. Oh, he's in trouble. <laughs> What's that? Troxicity. Ooh, none of these are effective against it. I don't know what I should switch to. Should I just fight? Let's just fight with Crunch. I am faster. I do get the first hit in. Uh, that didn't do great. That didn't do great. Oh, it's poisoned as well. Right, I might be going down here. But I don't think it's worth switching off because Alex is so weak and poisoned anyway. I think I should just get one good one good crunch in. One last crunch. And then I'll bring in another Pokemon to finish the job. Uh, this is an electric Pokemon. Yeah, I don't have any, like, uh, rock Pokemon. Because I think that's what would be uh, would be good against it. But, like, I've got, like, a really weird selection of, of, um, of Pokemon. Oh, so Psychic would be effective against it, actually. So I could bring out either Buttons or... Uh, should we bring out... Should we bring in Tap Out? Bring out my new Pokemon? I just want to I just want to go back and watch this screen later and see the uh, the reaction. I turn out to, to Bob J Gaming. Thank you for the uh, five pound donation. Uh, I think you are the best YouTuber I've ever watched. Uh, the best... Go wish you the best going forward. I uh, hope you and Squashy are well. Thank you very much. We're both doing good. Uh, Squashy will probably come and say hello in a, a moment. We've had someone staying for the weekend. We've been quite busy and we've, uh, as I said earlier, gone and picked up the Christmas tree and done the decorations. So she's a bit tired, but she'll probably pop in and say hello at some point. Oh, what an amazing Pokemon that is. God, it was super effective, but it only did a little bit of damage there. Team Squid for life. Get out of here. You're in the wrong stream. Ooh, hello, hello. You know what? I might just uh, switch out here, you know. Mr. Rhyme fits you so well. He's amazing, isn't he, Dolphin? Oh, no, they use Crunch. I thought they were going to use a fire move. This should do a lot of damage, though. This is a pretty high damage water move. Are they going to switch out Pokemon, though? That's the question. Should I have done a non-water move, assuming they're going to switch to something else? Oh, he is switching! He is! Gengar! Oh, what's good against Ghost? <laughs> Let me get my graph! Because I'm cheating. Uh, oh, other ghost and dark. Oh, I think I know a dark move. Yeah, sucker punch. This move enables this. Oh, it fails if they're not readying an attack, but they probably will be. This might destroy them. They wouldn't have assumed I know a dark move. I think this is really giving me an edge here. Uh, Lemon Blade says, "A uh, very important question: Were you ever sing your famous song? Oh, why is my?" I can't see all of these donations. Uh, oh, Diamond Mad again. Uh, I could do. So if, if I win, I'll sing the uh, the Diamond Mad song. I might have to listen to it again to, to remember how it goes. Oh, Alex has gone and, uh, and settled on the, uh, on the beanbag behind me. Oh, 
You just about see her behind the mic. There she is. There she is. And a wild squashy has entered the uh, the room as well. What's Dribble? What is his Pokemon? <laughs> oh, we're the same. We're matching. Should I Dynamax here? No, I'm gonna I'm gonna save it. Actually, if I do U-turn, then I can switch out and bring someone else in. Oh, they used U-turn as well. <laughs> Who are they going to switch to? So I can just counter whoever he switches to. Who's he got left? I'm battling Squid Nugget. Oh no, I should have stayed out. Is he watching my stream and, like, countering what I say I'm going to do? Because <laughs> that was a lot of luck. Why would he switch to a fire Pokemon and I have a water one out? <laughs> I don't have anything really effective against it, to be fair. I might just send out Tapat to die. <laughs> and then I can have a, a full health someone else for the, uh, for the Dynamax. <laughs> Uh, let's just use Psychic. Oh, I, I kind of want to Dynamax my tap out though, just because it would be so funny to see. <laughs> I think that's tap out going down here, though. We've got a good lead, though. We've got a good lead. Thanks for the uh, couple of donations, Declan. Um, who should we send out? Who should, we, should we Dynamax Copper? Actually, no, I should use Kappa when they send out their water Pokemon. Kappa! But they, they might just switch over now. Right, let's do it. I'm going to send out Kappa. Oh, Squid is cheating. Is he what? Is he watching me? Waiting. Is he watching and waiting? <laughs> about the chart. Uh, oh, he knows about the chart. <laughs> what chart? There's no chart here. <laughs> Quick, take the chart. Take the chart. <laughs> right, I'm going to be really slow selecting my move. Just so he he hasn't got any time to like respond. He's is he waiting for me to Dynamax? <laughs> squid, go away! Squid, leave! If you're watching Squid, Squid, no cheating. <laughs> right, I'm gonna Dynamax. Let's just do it. Let's just do it. Go bold or go home. Yeah, giant teapot. Squid is watching you. I knew he'd be cheating. Go away, Squid. <laughs> You're tainting my inevitable victory. <laughs> Don't tarnish this. <laughs> Everyone's saying leave Squid. Squid, go home. Squid, stop cheating. See, now he's Dynamax. <laughs> he's coffee. I knew it because he was taking so long to do all his moves. I'm going to change the stream so it's on like max delay and then he won't be able to copy. <laughs> Who's going to get to do their move in first? Go away, squid. <laughs> what am I doing? Oh, look where cheating got you, squid. Look where cheating got you. <laughs> and his last Pokemon's water. And Kappa knows a couple grass moves. So enjoy that one, squid. Cheaters never prosper. Um, right, let's use this. Oh, it's in his chat. He's not watching. People in his chat are telling him what you're doing. Oh, it's the chat so that are telling him. Oh, Squid is innocent. Squid is salty at you using a graph. Squid, you knew I had the graph. You knew. To be fair, I didn't actually need to use it. Because when you scroll through your Pokemon, it shows the moves and what is effective. So to be fair, it didn't actually, it didn't actually help me. Because the game just tells you now what's effective. I didn't actually need it. I like, don't get me wrong, I would have used it if I needed to. <laughs> right, that's it. GG's. Right, let me send let me send Squid a little GG. Stamp cheated. I didn't cheat. How did I cheat? What's he gonna What's he gonna say? Would you like to receive the opponent's lead card? Nah. Don't want that rubbish. GG graph boy. <laughs> Squid said GG graph boy. I didn't use the graph. I didn't need to use the graph. I went, if you want, I went to use the graph and then I saw that it, it just told you what was effective anyway. The graph played no factor 
in my victory. Right, let's, let's send GG in the chat. Just because it feels unnatural to not win a game without spamming GG somewhere. Right. Last a loser. Alright. Bye, Squid. Thanks for the fun. <laughs> right then! Let's get this uh, this stream back on back on track then. So yeah, I arrived at Wyndham. And I have the final battle. I assume it's going to be against Leon, the undefeated champion. But there's probably going to be like something that's going to happen uh, before then. Uh, but yeah, Hop just said go to the, the stadium to meet him here. Maybe we're just going to be able to go straight into it. Everybody go and congratulate Graf Boy. <laughs> GG Graf Boy. Hey, I I am proud to have a draft. A draft? I'm proud to have. Oh, why isn't it switching? There we go. I'm proud to have a draft. I got a gra I got a graph and a giraffe. <laughs> Stampy, correct? We've been watching your uh, over your performance in the gym challenge. This is uh, just a formality, of course, but I'll need to check your gym badges, if you don't mind. I'm all sorted, and I'm ready to batter you on the biggest stage of them all. But it looks like that uh, BD couldn't make it. Hard luck. Somehow I didn't think he'll just be... T uh, he'll just be... Somehow I didn't think he'll take being disqualified lying down. You know what I mean? I guess it is what it is. Come on, Stampy. We should head to the locker room. Alright, gotta do like a... Attention gym challengers who haven't made it through the gym challenge. The semi-finals will be starting soon. Please head to the stadium pitch when you're ready. Thank you. Alright, are we like... I didn't realise we were like straight, straight in, straight in. I didn't even buy any potions or anything. Did you choose the 117? Yeah. <laughs> Why is this guy guarding the vending machines? <laughs> I want to use the vending machine. I'm sorry, but only authorised people are allowed to get chalky bars. <laughs> Right, let's uh, let's go in then. Right, right, we're going straight. So, am I just battling Hop here, or am I going to go through all of them? Oh, the Diamond Mad song. All right, let me listen to it and re remember what it is. I'll put it in the chat as well for people that don't don't know what it is as well. Uh, Stampy. Diamond mad. Thank you very much for watching. So uh, the the context of it, you can kind of tell a bit from the video as well. Is that we just finished a video and then I just started like singing. Right, I do. I listened to a I listened to a clip of it. I just basically go like, they are pointy and make good swords. The diamonds, the diamonds, diamond, 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 diamonds. Diamond, 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 the diamonds. Basically, that's basically it. Huh. I knew you'd get all of the badges and meet me here. I know that there's been a lot between us, but with my big brother, Team Yell, helping uh, Spike Muff and all that. But in truth, uh, but the truth is, when all's said and done, I really just want to become a champion for myself. So don't take it personal when I kick your butt. Okay, we're not going against Hop yet. Looks like we have a, a few to make our way through. Uh, there's no game sound. Uh, are we? Oh, no game sound for me. I think there is. I think it might just be uh, a bit quiet. GG, chat boy. <laughs> he was way cheating. But his cheating affected the survival of Pokemon. My graph did nothing. Uh, right then. Straight into this. This is exciting. Oh, play rough. Play rough does loads of damage anyway. And if it's super effective, I'm going to destroy them. Look at that! <laughs> it's so funny because everyone's so, like, confident in this game and, like, huh, you can't beat me. Then they just ignore the fact that I beat them every time. Like, I never lose. 
Everyone's all like, huh, you're never going to be able to, like, take on my strong Pokemon. But, like, yes! You say that every time and I always win! Oh, uh, is they going to be, like, uh, I don't know who's going to be good against them. When in doubt, I always just bring out Wiggly Worm, because Wigg Wiggly Worm's just quite strong. Uh, who won? I had to leave, asked Wendy. I won! GG me! How are we doing for game audio? Is it is it loud enough now? So it's different music from the uh, the normal gym music. Everyone's still arguing about who cheated. This has been a bit of an easy one so far. Uh, Toxic Croak. That's going to be a poison Pokemon, right? He's going to be... <laughs> Bring out the graph. Oh, I'm cheating. Uh, okay. It's going to be good against poison. Oh, Ground and Soul Psychic. Should we give um, should we give old Tapat another another go in the ring? They're a little bit under leveled compared to some of my other Pokemon. I might have some rare candies or something to to give to them. Hey, look, guys, look, neither of us were cheating, okay? Apart from Squid, neither of us cheated. Oh, is it even a poison one? Ah, it is. Well, at least Psychic's super effective. Honestly, it was a, no. It was a completely fair, balanced fight of Pokemon with the better player winning. That's all that was, was to it. That's all there was. Aside from Squid cheating, it was just a perfectly normal, <laughs> straightforward Pokemon battle, which I won. And Squid cheated in, cheated and lost. <laughs> all right, send Wiggly Worm back out there. He does good. Budget version of Mr. R Mime. No, luxury version of Mr. Mime. Thank you very much. Nobody was cheating except Squid, says Denise. Make the music louder, Graph Boy! <laughs> let's start the rave! <laughs> Alright, let's start the rave, guys. God, is this, is this like the most dominant battle I've ever been in? I'm destroying! Squid messes me again. I think he's all upset with me now. Shall I buy, um... Shall I buy, buy Squid a graph for Christmas? Shall I buy him a Pokemon graph <laughs> as a Christmas present? <laughs> Turn it up louder, you say? I don't even know who they're sending out here. I've got everyone's cheers back at me. I'm really, really gonna win it this time. What do you mean, like, all of my Pokemon have basically one shot all of yours? How can you be in any way confident? Uh, I don't know if any of these moves are uh, effective against it. Can we just Dynamax here? They're pretty good at Dynamax against me. Let's um, preemptively Dynamax. I don't know which move to do here, though. Um, let's just do this. Let's do a ghost move. You should try and go on Strictly Come Dancing. I'd absolutely love that. But I'm like the worst dancer in the world. Maybe that's why I should go on the show. Be a better at dancing. Anyway, for our second time today, we can see a giant teapot. Oh, that's a ghost and fairy type. Get the graph out. Uh, so I want to use steel or poison? Or ghost or dark? Oh, I think I used a ghost move, didn't I? Have I just accidentally happened to use, like, the best one? Well, that's a disgusting potion, isn't it? Gonna get spiky. I think this should be super effective, though. Right? It's not very available okay, against the opposite. Okay. I think I might know a dark move though. Oh, it's dark fairy. Oh, it's gonna hurt me. Ah! 
It was going so well up until now. Low speed though. I can't hear you. I, tu I turned the music down just a little bit. So what should I what should I use against this guy then? I don't have any poison or steel moves, I don't think. To be fair, whoever I send out is probably gonna get taken out anyway. Maybe use a fighting moves against it. Let's send out Wiggly Worm, see if we can do some damage. Let's see what this does. He's probably gonna one-shot me anyway, just because he's a uh, like Gigantamax. Oh! Ooh, hello, hello, hello. That did good damage. That must have been super effective. It wasn't, it just did loads of damage. If I survive this, I reckon Wiggly Worm can finish them off. No! To be fair, they're so weak. They just need to be tickled by another one of my Pokemon. What I don't know, though, is am I going to need to do all of these battles in a row? Even if I can have a chance to heal up with potions, I might run out of potions. Uh, you had a steel move, did I? Oh, yeah, the uh, the steel wing move. Let's see whether that's uh, effective at all. To be fair, it's just not a very strong move anyway. Like, it's not very high power. I think it's like 60 or 70. What is it? Yeah, 70. We'll give it a go. Oh, they're healing him up. No! They were so nearly finished up. They completely healed them up. Hacker. They're hacking. All right, yeah. It was super effective. It didn't do loads of damage. But now they're, like, back to being small again. Uh, please turn it down. Is it still too loud? This is the thing where someone says turn it down, then I turn it down, and then straight away someone says to turn me up. Like, sometimes me streaming with this audio levels is just, like, people fighting over the remote control and, like, which, like, what volume they want it on. <laughs> hello, hello, hello. Yeah, okay, my... My mic's pretty loud on here. Hashtag they are hackers. Attention, Stampy, what is your favorite tea? Uh, I like PG Tips. I literally just finished a cup of it during the, the stream. It gets much harder after this. Well, I was doing so unbelievably good right until the, uh, the Gigantamax at the end. The good thing, though, is that, um, like, I'll level, like, after defeating them, the Pokemon that are still alive, at least, uh, will get leveled up. My fave tea is PJ Tips too. <laughs> Pajama Tips. All right, do I get a chance to... I kind of didn't realize, like, so much that I was going straight into the battle. Uh, okay, so I lost. But I got to see the good points of you and your Pokemon. A little bit bad now. Everyone's saying it's going to get really tough after this. Hopefully I'm leveled up enough. Everyone in the stadium was watching us during all of that. I heard them cheering for me and my Pokemon. It was nice. I may have lost, but at least we drove the audience wild. Guess that's not so bad. Think I'll join my brother at the stands and we'll watch from the sidelines. And who ends up challenging the champion? Just so you know, I still haven't decided if I'm going to cheer for you. See ya. Stampy! I'll be waiting for you in the final match. After seeing all the way uh, the way you battled, I can't accept any outcome besides winning this match. My team is on fire. All right, good luck, Hop. Hopefully see you in the finals. Huh, <laughs> someone wrote, what's your favorite dessert? And I read it as, what's your favorite desert? The Sahara is my favorite dessert. Uh, pardon me. I know you didn't get a long break, but the match before yours ended much more quickly than expected. Challenger Hop won quite handedly. So as soon as you're ready, we'd like you back on the pitch. I literally just got it. Uh, is there anywhere? Can I, can I go anywhere to heal up? How are my Pokemon? Are they all... Oh, no, I don't want to go to Pokemon. Yeah, let's go to Pokemon Camp. <laughs> let's do Pokemon Camp here. Okay, let's, uh, let's not do this. It's cool unless you do it there, though. Yeah, are they all still really weak? Ah, they've all been magically healed up. Good to know. All right, I think it's time for a little... Little cheeky save. Little cheeky save before we go into the next one. Oh my god, there's 2,000 people watching. Just about. Just over 2,000 people. 
There's not normally that many people watching. Hello, everyone. Hope you're having a good Sunday. Hello to everyone who's just jumping in. We're in the other uh, final challenge of Pokemon Sword. I just defeated my first opponent, and now I'm going up against my next. And apparently it's going to keep getting harder and harder from now on. Am I against Hop now? I just had this sort of flashback, you know, remember? Back when we were still at Potswick. Uh, when we got our Pokemon from Lee that day, I would have never have dreamed that I ended up standing here facing you in front of all of these people. It was only like five days ago. Calm down, Hop. But it's time I finish uh, what was started that day. Got it? The one who will become champion is me. Yeah, I've beaten you every time we've battled Hop. And we battle like five times a day. <laughs> uh, shout out to, to Liz for the uh, the, the donation of uh, $5. It uh, says, watch me since they're in elementary school and they're now off for college. Uh, I'll stay with you uh, as long as you keep making videos. I actually make every day uh, a little better. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Liz. Thank you for the donation. Thanks you for continuing to, to watch. I'm glad you enjoy the videos. They make your days better. And hopefully you're enjoying these, uh, these new streams uh, as well. Please stay focused. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm fully focused on the game now. What was that? No, sorry. Focus on the game. Obvious joke. Couldn't resist. Welcome back, dog woof. Oh, who are they sending out? I don't know who they're sending out. Let's just yeah, let's leave Wiggly Worm out there. Oh, cool. No, that's the fly. Oh, no, I should have sent Alex out. New. No. Should have been paying attention. Should have been paying attention. I did okay. That Alex could have probably one shot hit them and destroyed them. Well, what's scary face gonna do? Wasn't that scary? I wasn't scared, but I'm very, very brave. Takes a lot to scare me, just because of how brave I am. No! Oh, I was getting another hit in. No! Oh, that was my bad. That could have all been avoided if I paid attention and sent out Alex. Getting a little bit scared here, guys. I'll be honest. I tend to do okay until they Dynamax, and I always mess up my Dynamaxing. That's where I always end up messing up. But now I'm messing up straight away anyway. Right, let's use Wild Charge. This probably would have one-shot them. If I didn't send out the wrong Pokemon. I really want to stay, but I want to avoid ending spoilers. Uh, and I have maths homework. Do your maths homework. Finish the game. You can always watch this back on VOD. At a later date. Uh, about to send out Snorlax. Uh, who should I send to go up against Snorlax? Like, he's just normal, isn't he? Um, I don't know who to send send after them. Let's send out Tapat. Why not? I have like two psychic Pokemon, so I might as well send one of them out. Use your graph, graph boy. Uh, right, I don't really know what this guy's moves are yet, to be honest. So, oh, that will put down their special defense. I know, I, yeah, I could put that, actually. This attack enables users to attack first. Attacking first doesn't really matter for now. Super effective on water type. Right, let's just use Psychic. Oh, no, its move was super effective. What was Miracoat? Mm, so they're not really using special attacks. They're just going to have to whittle, whittle Snorlax down. The thing is, Snorlax can do the things where it puts it to sleep. And then it, um, it heals itself back up, which is what I'm worried about. Uh, Wiggly Worm is super effective. Okay, let's send that Wiggly Worm then. Oh, no, I won't. She's taken out. Right, no one else I have is super effective. 
Let's just do someone who's got like a high damage move. Let's send out uh, Alex again. Snorlax has weak physical defense. Okay. So this uh, electric move is like a, a physical attack. There we go. Okay. That did much better. I assume it'd be like his like stronger physical defense and weaker special. Shows what I know. I could um start using some revives here. I might uh, revive Wiggly Worm. Yeah, that didn't do too much damage. And then let me give a potion to Wiggly Worm. Uh, set them up for a future. Stampy, would you sell your account for... I don't know what number that's meant to be, but for a very large number per day? Uh, yeah, I totally would. So i like, fix world hunger. <laughs> I'm making you a cat. Uh, Joshua was saying, what have I missed so far? Uh, I bowed against Squid. And I won. Uh, and now I'm in like the, the, the final challenge. I'm going against uh, against Hop. And he's going to destroy me right now. But we're kind of going back and forth. But it's, it's close. It's close. Uh, use fire Pokemon. I do not have any fire Pokemon. If I did, I would. Uh, let's just send buttons out, shall we? Yeah, I haven't really got like a, a very uh, <laughs> balanced selection of Pokemon. I just picked the ones that I thought looked cool. Which is probably not the, uh, the most effective way to play this game, but my favorite way to play the game. Uh, Huckleberry Flynn says, great job stamps. Be sure to go to move a uh, relearner. I'm sure what that means. Be sure to go to move. Is there, is there a move called Relearner? Oh, what are they do? They, they heal him up. Ah, oh, so annoying. Hop is cheating. He has a graph, says Swampfire. I knew it! <laughs> to be fair, I know their last Pokemon is going to be a fire Pokemon. So I can send out a war Pokemon and uh, Dynamax them. So I should be okay. Oh, at the Pokemon Center? Declan says, Stampy, you don't notice me. Please notice me. And if you don't, I'm, ups I'm unsubscribing. <laughs> you can unsubscribe if you want, Declan. I mean, I've noticed you now, so I guess you don't have to. <laughs> All right, let's bring out... Um, I always forget their name. The Interleon. Interleon? Interleon? Interleon. Interleon. Inter... Inter Whatever their name is. Let's bring them out. And let's just Dynamax straight away. And use a water move. Because I reckon they're just going to go straight in with a Dynamax fire move. And I should destroy them here. There should be like... An, unless they're like a stupidly high level. Like there should be like no contest. Uh, well, they're only level 49. I should have this. If I just do this. Use Max Geyser. I reckon we're both going to Dynamax here and I should get the win. It's good enough. So it used to be in the old games when you did like like the equivalent of this bit. Your Pokemon didn't get healed up between battles. You'd have to use all your potions and stuff. And they're nicer now. And they actually heal up your, your Pokemon for you. Which makes it much nicer. Well, hello, baby poodle. Welcome back. Uh, give uh, a shout out to someone in the, the chat. Sure. Uh, let me pick someone with a funny name. It's kind of the uh, the normal way I do this. Uh, it's got a funny name. Shout out to Mr. Potato. Thanks for watching.
It's quite fitting that we're we're ending this battle by both using our like evolved starter Pokemon as well. Yeah, that's a, that's the way I thought it was gonna go though. <laughs> I got the better one. Look how tall he is. It's just the camera cuts their head off. Look, look at them side by side. You can't even see my one's head. Uh, they always Dynamax the last Pokemon. Yep. Yeah, they always Dynamax the last one. So you can always assume when they're going to Dynamax. It kind of makes it a little bit less like strategic because you know they always do the, the last one. But hey, I'll use it to my advantage. Right. You're out. Oh, I feel bad. He's been so confident this whole time. He just keeps losing every time we battle. Thanks, Stampy, mate. Uh, I'm really glad you were the one here with me. And then he just gives me like six grand. <laughs> Why did he give me six grand then? <laughs> and the victor of the semi-finals, uh, the challenger who has won their way through all of the many hopeful trainers in the gym challenge is... Challenger Stampy! You know, even when Sonya was saying that you and me look like we could become heroes, I really never felt like one. But you, mate, I think maybe you really could do all sorts of great things. Good on you, Stampy. And Phalanx and, Phalanx and I and the, all the rest of your team. Hop should have used a graph. <laughs> oh, he died? I thought I was going to end up battling Leon. No. Oh, someone's telling me to. Oh, here, here we go. Here he is. Here he is. He found his way to the arena. Then he didn't get lost. Stubby! That was uh, incredible. Brilliant. Honestly, there was even tears rolling down my face before I knew it. To think that the two of you set out together from the same town, filled up the greatest teams and arrived here at this point to throw everything you had at one another? That burning desire to win, those moves filled with undefeatable passion. It was battling at its very purest in every possible way. Even though there were some trainers who weren't sure whether you were fit to be endorsed for the gym challenge at first. That was you, Lee. <laughs> well then, all the more reason. My team members and I will give everything that we've got uh, in order for us to defeat our challenger. And the challenger standing before us might well end up being you, Stampy. In fact, that's precisely what I'm hoping for. That's right, Stampy. The real challenge is what's coming next. And I'm completely exhausted. I just want to head back to the hotel and rest. Best to refill your energy stores first. Why don't we go and get some dinner together? I wouldn't say no, but... You can uh, never care, you never care at all what food tastes like, Lee. Uh, a night like this deserves more than rubbish takeaway, so at least pick something good. You should have named your character Hop. <laughs> That'd be well funny. Hi, Hop, said Hop to Hop. How's it going, Hop? Hop inquired. I'm doing good, thanks, Hop, said Hop to Hop. Anyway, we better run. Yes, Hop. Let's hop to it, said Hop to Hop. Hop and Hop hopped down the... <laughs> Challenger Stampy! Hey, Challenger Stampy. Got some time for some questions? First question. You and Challenger Hop were both endorsed by the champion, making you the two rivals in a sense, wouldn't you say? How does it feel to have defeated your rival? Uh, I'm glad I could beat him. It doesn't quite feel real, real yet. It was just luck. It wasn't luck. I destroyed him. Uh, I'm glad I could beat him. Right, question number two. If you wanted to tell Challenger Hop something right now, what would it be? He's standing next to me! Probably be like, where should we go for dinner? Uh, I'd thank him for the great match. I'd tell him how strong he was. Uh, that he was just the rival I knew he was. Why did they were like the same thing? I want one to be like, yeah, I thrashed that idiot. You know, <laughs> I just want one really angry one. <laughs> question three. Level with me, kiddo. Your honest thoughts here. Think you can win the finals too? Uh, yeah, probably. All right, that's enough. Stumpy's already tired from the battle, and you're being asked rather rude questions. They weren't rude. Uh, we've got ourselves dinner plans with my brother, so sorry, you can clear off already with you. You're the one being rude, Hop. Yes, yes, I understand. Looking forward to seeing the birth of a new star. Uh, Hello Woo says Stamps uh, wear Squash, uh, also Terraria 1.3 or 1.2. Uh, like, you asked me to pick between them. I don't know the difference. Uh, Squish, she was here a second ago. Uh, she's just gone off with Alex right now. Um, but yeah, she's around. She might pop back in later. Phew! Famous people sure have it rough, eh? I hope Lee gets here soon. I could eat my own arm about now. Several hours later. This is absurd. Even Lee's never this late. Something's not right. 
He always does what he's... Uh, la, 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 la. As a kid, he promised uh, me he'd become champion one day. And then he just went and did that. He ought to be able to keep uh, to his own dinner plans. Kids sure gonna melt on him, huh? If you were that noisy during battle, you'd unleash a whole new level of power, you know. Oh, pack it in, Piers. I'm seriously worried here. So I don't need to see your smug mug looking like you're having a go at me, even though you act like you're giving me good advice. Judging by appearances, no wonder you lost your uh, to your mate. If you're looking for the champion, I saw him heading to Rose Tower. Rose Tower? Don't know why what he's up to, but I ran into him at the uh, monorail platform. He said uh, to tell you that he had something to do at Rose Tower, so he'd be late to your dinner. But why Rose Tower? What could he have to do there at this hour? Pierce, do us a favour. Take us to Rose Tower, would you? Neither Stampy or I know the way. Oh, sheesh. What rude siblings. Always so demanding of others. Uh, though, suppose. It's a real problem for me, too, if the finals are held up for any reason. I really don't, uh, I really, uh, I don't really hate the two of you little runts. Uh, so you were good enough to beat me after all. So I think I'm invite blah, blah, blah. Yes, yes, yes. Pretty, pretty, pretty. Right, let's go to, let's go to Rose Tower. <laughs> hop, 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 no pop. The real reason Leon's a champion is because he's using a graph. Are you taking me then? Man, why am I here for this? I'm totally exhausted from the battle with you, Stampy. We decided that Team Yell will cheer you on. Stumpy, let's head out together. What a beautiful display of sibling love. However, it is entirely unnecessary. Mrs. Alina. Chairman Rose is with the champion in a very, very important meeting. There is no way I'll let anyone interfere. After all... Only authorised personnel with the proper key can ride the monorail to Rose Tower. That means as long as Chairman Rose is in the tower, no one can disturb him. I have hand-selected a member of the League staff and given them a key. Chairman Rose does enjoy these kind of menial games after all. Do you think you can tell the difference between normal League staff and the one I chose? Do you think you can find me? What should we do? Oh, this isn't good, but I got this one. Uh, Stampy, team yells, yelling with... Uh, I'm just going to read through this really quick. This is taking forever. No, this is brilliant. I'll search around in front of the stadium. Right, so we're looking for a key for the monorail. Uh, I should head to the plaza. Yes, let's go to the plaza. You go to the plaza. All right, let's go together to Rose Tower. Uh, let's find the, uh, the league staff member... He was wearing, oh, he was wearing sunglasses. Okay, so we're looking for one wearing, like, sunglasses, I guess. What happens if I try and talk to one of the other ones? Okay, let's just go around and just talk to all of them. So what, were they wearing, like, darker sunglasses? Like, the characters, like, only, like, load in when you get really close to them. I haven't explored London either. I do want to buy some, like, uh, some more clothes and stuff as well. Oh, hello. Do you reckon it's this one? Hey, Stumpy, this bloke's awfully shifty, but I can't get him to turn around. Say something surprising so I have no choice but to look this way. Uh, let's say that. We've already taken the key. What? Yeah, he's wearing dark sunglasses. Blast! I turned around and I can't escape. In that case, time for a Pokemon battle! Shout out to, uh, Pax Steven. Pax Steven. Says, I love your channel, Stampy. Uh, good luck with, uh, Leon. He's a tough one. Oh, really? Is Leon tough? I thought it'd be okay, because, like, my, like, one of my best Pokemon's a water Pokemon. And, like, the only Pokemon I've seen of his is Charizard. So I assumed I should be able to do okay against him. But I have no idea what his other Pokemon are. Uh, yes, he's very tough. Okay. I will I will have to be careful. Uh, Leon is tougher than you would think. 
Do you reckon I'm ready, guys? Have I, like, leveled up? Oh, Leon has level 60s. What? Do I need to, like... Do I need to level up a bit? I might need to level up a bit, then. If he's got level 60... Because, like, this guy's using, like, level 47. Like... Level 47 to, to 50 is quite big. Oh, you joining in? Uh, I think you're going to be okay. Oh, yeah. Don't forget the grass starter. I forgot about that. I did forget about that. Leon has grass as well. I don't really have much good against grass. So I don't have any fire Pokemon. I might have to, to capture some more Pokemon before I go after him. I we'll have to change the name of the stream from something other than finishing the game. <laughs> I didn't realize it was going to be all of this stuff. <laughs> Alright, so at least we have the, the key. Well, what do I do? Do I go after him? Should I just do it? Or do we go and level up? You'll be fine. You have the graph. It's become like a mystical item. Like the graph of power. Been handed down from generations. The ancient artifact will give the power of effective Pokemon move choices to the wielder. Um, level up. Catch some more. Okay, a lot of people are saying level up. Get a fire Pokemon. Level up. Right, we might have to, we might have to do that then, guys. What I need to do is hide. And I won't have to give you the key. Oh, I don't run. Why are we letting them run away? Okay, right. We're going to go track him down again. Right, come on then, Glasses McGee. Where are you? Where are you hiding this time? Like, could he go up here somewhere? Is it like anywhere in the city or just in the plaza? This is a cool park. Let's do a let's do a loop de loo. Oh, that was like really jarring when it changed camera. Ah, oh, so this is meant to be the Thames. This is cool for anyone who's like been or like lives in London. It is cool to see it. I love the way the uh, the monorail as well is like red buses. <laughs> so I was thinking it's a bit weird that there is a monorail. Considering, like, the fact that there isn't a, uh, a monorail in London. Should I get a new t-shirt? Let's see what they have. There's the, they have no t-shirts here? They got any cool hoodies? Any cool shoes? Oh, there's some pretty funky shoes here, to be fair. I like them ones. Let's get these. Let's get some loafers. Let's get some colourful loafers. Uh, Princess Gatcha says, I'm a huge fan. Uh, good luck with the, the battle. Thank you very much. Yeah, I think I'm going to need luck, to be honest. I think I need luck and, like, more Pokemon. <laughs> to be fair. <laughs> Should probably uh, heal up my, uh, my current Pokemon as well. Uh, hey, Sam, just ignore the guy, uh, the key guy, and buy a shirt. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I thought you are giving me advice. <laughs> You're just commenting on <laughs> the weird way I'm playing the game. I did kind of do that, didn't I? I did kind of... <laughs> I did kind of ignore the big important mission I'm meant to be doing to go and buy some new loafers. <laughs> uh, right, where is he then? It's not... No, that's the Team Yell guy. I'm assuming it's somewhere around here then. Oh, is this him? That's not him. Let's speak to him anyway, just to make sure. No. He's not down here, so is this just going to, like, take me out the area? Yeah, I think it is. Oh, is this him here? Oh, here he is. How did you find... What do you mean, how did you find me? You've moved, like, 50 meters away from where you were standing before. How could I not find you? In fact, it's kind of impressive how long it took for me to find you, considering how little you moved and how obvious your hiding place was.
Oh, I didn't see who's going to bring out. I, I hate the fact that it pops up for a second which Pokemon they're going to bring out. And then it goes away when you switch through. Why doesn't it just leave on screen who the next Pokemon's going to be? Like, I always I always skip through it. And it's like, I'm going to bring out this Pokemon. And then they don't leave it up. And I always miss it. And they've always done that in all the Pokemon games. They've never, like, improved that. Where can I get that hat? You know, this hat is actually really comfy. It's like so, it's so roomy. Like I need a lot of excess, excess space in my hats just for my hair. And this, this, uh, this Eevee one has plenty of that. I wonder if I take my glasses off, I can like, <laughs> it's, it's more of like a mask. I mean, I can't see anything what I'm doing, but. <laughs> okay. That's not gonna work. It is comfy. It's like, it's like a head hug. A hug for your head. Anyway, let's uh, <laughs> back to the game. Uh, they say hide a tree in a forest, so I thought I could hide myself in the crowd. In the crowd! Would you be next to the two people talking? Right, he ran off this way, but he could have just gone anywhere. Oh, nope, he's right here. All of his brilliant hiding places. Uh, your voice is too quiet. Should I turn it up a bit? Right, I am turning up my voice. Hello! My voice is getting louder, louder. My voice is getting louder. My voice is getting louder. Is that too loud? Is my voice too loud? Is it too loud? Is it okay? How's my voice? Is my voice okay? Hello, how's my voice? Too loud, too loud? It's better? Your voice is better. So quiet. So quiet and too loud are literally written back to back. Too loud. Too loud. I'll turn it down. Too loud. Loud. Too low. Louder. Okay. I realize I'm, I'm just going to have to watch the chat. <laughs> the stream back and see for myself. Because literally back to back people are saying it's too quiet or it's too loud. So. <laughs> I don't mean the stream overall. Because. You can turn that up or down on your end. It's just compared to, like, the game. Perfect. Someone said perfect. Right, I'm going to listen to that person. Too quiet. Too loud. Perfect. Too loud. Too quiet. Too loud. Too quiet. Too loud. I should just trick you all by going, like, Hello! I know we're going to be going down. <laughs> okay, which Pokemon shall I send out? Uh, let's just let's give someone else a go. Let's give uh, Topat another another chance in the, the ring. All right, a lot of people saying perfect. I'm just going to choose to listen to them and ignore everyone else. <laughs> Too much in the middle. Oh, I should not have switched to this guy, I don't think. Do I have anything effective? Uh, let's try freeze dry. I did the trick, didn't it? Seems like you got me cornered, uh, but I'm not going to give up. Oh, she, are they going to run away again? Good luck catching me on the monorail. Are they running to the monorail? All right, let's, uh, let's heal up and chase. You did a cracking job of cornering that bad league staff member, Stampy. Let me sing you a song fitting of your rocking deeds. The only thing a humble singer can do is sing a humble song. Maybe I can cheer someone on with just the tunes I play. Maybe my songs don't make me happy. Maybe I can't help. But still, the only thing I can do is sing. Sing my humble song. 
Go Piers! Piers, go Piers! Hey, isn't that Piers? Why is he doing a street performance? I think you mean a station performance. Come on, let's see if we can get closer. This is like one of those like really naff adverts where people start like dancing or singing in the street. And they're like, what's going on? They're dancing, sponsored by T-Mobile? What's happening? <laughs> was just running down, knocking them out of the way. <laughs> so weak, he's meant to be singing, it's just silence. <laughs> Stumpy, hop, now's your chance, go, get out of here. Right, onto the monorail. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Donated and said one plus one equals question mark. Sorry, I'm not good at maths. I don't know the answer. Uh, Samzy Games and Vlogs says, I hope you're having a good day. I am having a good day. Thank you. So this is Rose Tower. Just how tall do you think it is? I can't even see the top up there in the clouds. So what are we going to do? Team Yell's going to have their hands full holding up those bad guys, staff members. Uh, they won't be catching up anytime soon. Yeah, Stampy, what should we do? Uh, let's go. Good thinking. Let's go collect Lee and get out of here. Without him, there's no champion for you to challenge in the Champion Cup. Stampy, you cleared your way to the Rose Tower. Uh, now all you've got to do is charge on ahead. An employee's an employee, I guess. Sees that exact lady hit the monorail key to try and impress the chairman. Chairman Rose has been keeping the chairman holed up inside. Wonder what he's plotting. <laughs> I love that guy's walking animation. Times like this when tension and passion run high remind me of Spike Muff in the old days. Some right world concerts we had back then, but no encores. Wait, you're still here? You better get going. I'll send support, uh, support your way with a yell. Gotta stick around to make sure my bro doesn't do anything too crazy, right? Come back if you need anything. Let's go, Stampy. Right, let's go and make our, our way up the, the tower, shall we? Are we all are we all healed up? We're not all healed up. Eh, we're not too damaged anyway though. Oh, is Abdallah here? Are we am I being raided again? Oh, nice hat. <laughs> Thank you. I was just telling to the chat a second ago how it's like a a warm hug for my head. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, it's huge in here. What in the world is this place meant to be? Are we just... <laughs> oh, it's under the ground. I thought we were just like walking through the um, like the flower bed. Listen, Stampy. God, how do you water those flowers? Uh, anyway, sorry, I'm focusing far too much on the flowers. <laughs> considering what's going on. Don't know if you know this already, but I've heard Rose Tower was built on a power spot. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Uh, when we get up to the roof uh, and have a bit of a uh, space, we can Dynamax our Pokemon. Which is all well and good, but less certain is whether this lift can get us to the top. Rose Tower has like a hundred floors, right? You'll be leaving right now, so there's no need to worry about the lift. How big's the lift? Could Dynamax a Pokemon inside the lift? Intruder alert! Intruder alert! All staff are ordered to help remove the intruders from the premises at once. See, if Mrs. Olina says so, that's her voice, uh, then it looks like this is the end of the line for you kids. If I get rid of the intruders, I'll probably get a big bonus. All right, I think we're going to be battling our way up the uh, the tower in order to... Uh... Yeah, see what's going on. I always had my doubts about the, the chairman, him and his Rose Tower. I think Rose Tower is meant to be the shard. There's a, um, a very tall building in London called the shard. This seems very, uh, very similar. Uh, question, when the game finishes, will you still play slash stream slash catch Pokemon? Well, I, I probably... I'll probably end up doing like one more stream of this, I reckon. Like, just to see if I can get... Like, I'd like to get at least one shiny Pokemon. Just to see what it's like. Just to dip my toe in. 
And then I'd also maybe like to do a stream just like, I'd probably want to do one final battle against Squid as like the decider, because we're 1-1 one, one at the moment. If you realize that, we're equal. So we could have a decider against Squid and then another stream just battling viewers because that's always really, really good fun. So I'd love to, to do that again. I probably won't do loads and loads capturing loads of people. But my, my bonus. We need to speak to Chairman Rose. Tell us where he is. Get on the lift. The chairman's at the top of the building. All right, we, uh, we're we nearly to Chairman Rose. Hold on, Lee. We're coming. Come on, Stampy. Let's crack on. Uh, right, I want to play it safe here. Like, someone would probably heal up my Pokemon. But I can use just, like, a super potion, I guess, on Wiggly Worm. I've, like, loads of them. Do I have any uh, rare candies or anything? Or like any of the candies? Could it be in here? Or in like in the berries? Don't think I do. Maybe we're just gonna have to soldier on. Why is the lift so big? Are we gonna have to like keep battling people on the, the way up? Simon Z in games and vlogs says stamps and his voices. Ha, what man? <laughs> the lift is like the whole building. This hat's like pushing my like ringlets in my eye. I had, like one like hair just like literally curling around and like <laughs> digging into my eye. <laughs> Sell your useless stuff. Yeah, I will. I will when I get to a shop. I got like those pearls and stuff. Uh, what? I don't think we're at the roof yet. Why have we stopped? Ah, uh, I knew it. I knew we were going to have to keep battling on the, the way up. <laughs> blah, 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 blah. Blah, 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 blah. Blah, 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 Let's battle. Someone said play the game? I am playing the game. I uh, have no idea what's going to be effective here against either of these guys. Let's just use this because it's my strongest move. Anyone know what would be effective against these guys? Oh, I mean, that did all right. <laughs> Wasn't super effective, but it did the job. Uh, there's Steel. All right, let's get my Cheaty Graph out. So I want to use fire, fire, fighting or ground. Um, I don't have any fighting or anything. I don't have any fire Pokemon either. Not having a fire Pokemon has been really like messing me up a lot. I just haven't found any. I don't think there's as many po fighting. Uh, fire ones and there's not been like there's been some that have been powerful and there's been some that I like the look of but I hadn't found any fire ones that are strong and I like I gotta get that Charmander at the end of the game that's what I need once I got that Charmander I'm gonna evolve it up to a Charizard and then then I'll be set use Giraffe Arium see I would use Giraffe Arium but he's just a bit OP He's just a bit too strong. It's a bit unfair. Uh, what about uh, Score Bunny? Yeah, Score Bunny's good, but I don't. I can't get one. I chose Sobble at the beginning. Uh, do you remember the game Unravel? I do, Zoe. I do. Uh, I played Unravel too as well. I didn't stream it or like do videos on it. Uh, but Squashy and I played through it, and it's really good. It's better than the first one on Ravel 2. But I'd recommend only, probably only play it uh, if you're playing it co-op. So I could imagine it not being anywhere near as fun solo. But yeah, Ravel 2 co-op was really, really good fun. Great soundtrack as well, and it just looks amazing. Don't know who to send out here. Let's just send out buttons. Why not? I'll trade you a spare score bunny. No, I don't want to try. I want to earn my Pokemon. Let's see what Steel does against 
against steel. To be fair, Hopper's done like nothing in this battle. Okay, that did n literally nothing. <laughs> Uh, try a psychic move. Do a bit of experimenting here. Talk more gameplay. Talk about what's happening. I mean, there's not much. <laughs> I did a move. Wasn't effective. <laughs> like, I don't want these, uh, these streams just to turn into just like a straight let's play where like all I'm doing is just saying about what's happening. Like, the thing where I like it is it's just a bit more relaxing just kind of chat about other stuff while playing. Like when there's nothing like exciting going on. And when there is something exciting going on, then I can like focus on the gameplay. God, how many moves have we done against this guy? Like none of these moves are good against it, are they? Let's give Cupper a go. Uh, do you remember Pixelmon with Squid? Yeah, of course I do. That was really good fun. Uh, are you getting the legendary? I certainly tried to. Some girl says, I prefer your rambling. It's it's uh, it's calming. <laughs> it's good. Like, I already think these streams are going to be perfect for, um, like, multitasking. If you're, like, playing a game or, like, it's on in the background while you're doing something else. I think it'd be good. I mean, you can give it your full attention as well. Feel free. But, like, that's how, like, if I was to watch a stream, I'd watch it. But I'm weird because I like if I'm watching a stream, I just I never watch the chat. I think a lot of people watch streams really focusing on the the chat. But for me, I just like full screen the full screen the stream. Wait, so the folks working in the tower can stop the elevator from the outside at any time? We're just trying to get to the top already. Our teams have been working themselves ragged for us. Let's heal them all up. Why can't I, why can everyone magically wave their arm and heal Pokemon apart from me? That, you know what they should do? That at the end of the uh, the game, there should be a special item that does that. You should get the magic, like, heal the Pokemon with the force. They're like, oh, your Pokemon's weak, let me just heal them. Zoop. It's like, why can't I do that? Why can't everyone just do that apart from me? I have to go and pour loads of potions down their necks in order to heal them up. <laughs> Uh, do a live Q&A. That's basically what I'm doing. <laughs> I'm just being like selective with the questions. So questions that keep coming up like again and again and again. I just like ignore now. Just because I've answered them so many times. Like the main thing is like requests to do things that like I'm not planning to do. Like, you know, a lot of messages saying like, oh, play do Lovely World, play Terraria, like start this series again, do building time, like these same questions. But like anytime I see a question I've not answered before, or like not answered much and I want to answer then like I answer them so it's kind of is a Q&A. Uh, what is your favorite Pokemon this gen? It's so close between like Yampa and Sinistee. I think if like you force me like you have to answer which one I think I'd probably go for Yampa I think. I think the thing that tips me over the edge for loving Yampa is Yampa's tongue. The way the tongue is just always hanging out and the big goofy smile. Like, how can you not love that? How does that not make a great Pokemon? Uh, have you fought Leon? No. I'm on, well, I'm not on my way to fight Leon. I think I'm on my way to rescue him from this tower so that I can then fight him. <laughs> so who should I use against this guy? It doesn't say... So, um, maybe we could try some grass moves. Let's bring out Cuffer. Uh, how many gym badges do you have? I've got all of them. I've collected every gym badge. We're like right at the uh, the end of the game now, I think. Unless, there, unless there's more stuff going on. Did you know there's two forms of Sinistee? I didn't. I didn't know that. Is there a big difference between them? Squid says, can you do more building time? Uh, well, it got a bit boring last time, Squid, because I just kept winning. 
You know, if it was more balanced and it was fair, you know, like maybe it would be a bit more exciting. But just because I was like uh, so much better at building than you were, mainly because I had my uh, my building graphs, <laughs> it really uh, really made it really made it easier. And yes, I still I still got my graph, by the way, Squid. Still got my graph. My my golden my golden um golden ticket <laughs> to win the fight. <laughs> Take it, you're finished. Uh, you're you're finished streaming now. Yeah, Squid, if you're still there, I was actually just saying this. Like, I think once we've both completely finished the game, we should have our deciding battle, because you won the first one and then I won the second. So we're like, we're neutral. I think we need one more battle to like, have as the, the decider. Once we're both like, ready for it. Psh, some people. I I bet Leon doesn't have a graph. <laughs> That's why he's undefeated, Squid. The only reason he's undefeated is because he has a graph. All of the best Pokemon trainers have a graph. I was saying that I didn't actually use the graph. I didn't need to. So I didn't realize now, when you get to switch out Pokemon as you scroll through, it says like what moves are effective. So to be fair, joking aside, I didn't even use the graph. But you were cheating with the chat, and I know it. <laughs> I know it! You do exactly what I was going to do every time. And I still won! <laughs> Can we get a graph shirt? Oh, that'd be great merch. <laughs> like, like, got a graph and proud. <laughs> <laughs> just like graph boy, graph girl, and <laughs> then like a graph. <laughs> oh, that would be great. But like only you would know what it, it would confuse everyone. Like I know there's like, well, like 2,000 people here, but like everyone else would have no idea what that's from. But does that make it kind of a bit better though? Would that make it funnier? <laughs> I wasn't. Check my stream. Okay. Well, everyone said you were cheating, Squid. I'll take your word for it. Get a graph emote. <laughs> that would be funny. <laughs> a graph boy, graph girl emote. It's cool, because if I end up doing that, you're all, like, witnessing history right now. Like, if this ends up becoming, like, our little our little meme on the channel, like, you were here for the, uh, the birth of it. It's like a proud thing, you know? When people are like, Oh, this graph thing's so funny. You could be like, yeah, well, I knew Graph Boy before it was cool. <laughs> <laughs> I watched Squid stream and he didn't cheat. Yeah, he paid you to say that. How much did he pay you to say that? Oh, look at the graph emote. Is that uh, AIBZ? Abes? Everyone, everyone find that emote and spam it. Where is that? We'll be the only, like, YouTube stream using graph. Oh, there's loads of them! Where'd you find them? Like, symbols? I can't find it. Everyone, everyone spam your, your graphs <laughs> in the chat. Are you going to change your name to Stampy Long Hat? <laughs> Look at all the graphs! <laughs> Never in a stream have so many graph emotes been spammed. Like, how often would that emote be used? You know? Like, who else is using that emote? <laughs> it's so great. <laughs> oh, dear. Stampy long graph. The thing is, is there's people who's just clicked on the stream right now. Like, every second someone uses, like, clicking on the stream. And they're so confused. Everyone keeps spamming graphs for ages. And just waiting until you see the comments, like, popping up saying, like, What's going on, guys? <laughs> why why is everyone spamming graphs? <laughs> oh, there's squid of his graphs. That's what I love. I love that when someone comes in and they're just like, What is going on? Why is everyone spamming graphs? <laughs> in the chat. Don't you presume to meet the chairman? You're not on the same level as a great man. You must know that in high rises such as this one, the higher you go up, the more important the people you'll find working there. Chairman Rose is at right at the very top, not just of the tower, but of all of Gala. <laughs> Do 
Looks as though we're nearly there, mate. Look sharp. Let's do this. Graphy long no nose. <laughs> noise. We done it. We arrived. This is the top of the building. Right, we should be able to Dynamax up here as well. Luckily, they have like an enormous stadium-sized dome on the top of the skyscraper. Is this maths class? Uh, hello? Oh, I'm playing. <laughs> I thought it was a cutscene. I thought it was a cutscene. I was like, why is nothing happening? Right, he's going to use his Charizard last. Actually, I'm probably not battling Leon here, am I? I'm probably battling Rose. Let's send out uh, let's send out Wiggly Worm first though, because he um he does a good job holding his own. Get him myself a little cheeky save before we jump in. Welcome to Chairman Rose's executive space. Here, nearly a thousand feet above the earth. So you got through all the special stuff that I had ordered to stop you. I'd expect nothing less of the trainers handpicked by champion Leon himself. But I'm afraid it is now time for you to go home. Because? I will not allow anyone to disturb the great champion rules! You shall be the first MP! I will beat you to pieces and the champion will have no one to battle and then thus loose- Whoa, whoa, what did she say? I will beat you to pieces and the champion will have no one to battle and will thus lose heart. In that state, he will listen to anything the chairman says. He will have known to battle and then he will lose heart. Right. Battle time. Frost Lasso. So she's an ice Pokemon. Let's get the gra graph time, guys. Graph time. So fire, obviously. Oh, fighting rock and steel. Right. I know some good fighting moves. This should do a lot of damage. Oh, did I not? Did I not hit them? Did I miss? Wasn't paying attention. Oh, now I'm burnt. It doesn't affect the. Oh, are they ghost type? Oh, I just did the same move in a row as well. Right, graph time. <laughs> so, ghost. We want to use another ghost or dark. None of, the, none of these are going to cut it, are they? I could send out Alex and use Crunch. Stampy used Graph. It was super effective. I need like a grass cam. I need to be like... So just at any point, just cut to Graph cam. So I just need Graph cam here like this. I carry on playing. It's like, quick, graph cam! <laughs> right, let's try. Let's try crunch. Should do good. Hey, there we go. No need to panic, guys. You're getting a little bit scared. <laughs> she is not happy about it. My, how cheeky! <laughs> That's not what I expected her to say. Stampy will probably not finish the game, says Justin. Is that a challenge? Yeah, I don't know how I don't know how much longer the, the game is. If the game's like way longer, then I won't. I thought I was right at the end. Then all of this stuff started happening. But oh, another dark move. Uh, the user faints while using this move. In return, this harshly lowers the target's attack. Mm. No, nah, I don't want I don't want that move. I don't want it. I don't want to make myself faint. Oh, who did it say they're using? Who, who should I switch? I didn't see who they're using. Who should I switch to? Let me wait for the chat. I, I, I generally need your help now because I don't want to fail. Who do I need to switch to? Who, who, are they, uh, who are they using? The game is a lot longer and the post game is a big storyline. Okay. Maybe I won't finish it today. Uh, use Alex. Stay in. Stay in. Keep, keep Alex out. Okay. I'm trusting your your opinion here, guys. Don't switch. Don't. I guess I want to use uh, electric then. I guess. 
Guys, you're legends. You're literally legends. You know what? Forget the graph cheating. You guys are like <laughs> such like a trump card to help me out. So useful. Thank you so much. Wants to learn Tita dance. Uh, normal move. The user performs a wobbly dance that confuses Pokemon around it. <laughs> what a stupid move. Yeah, we are the graph. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, I didn't look again. Who, who should I switch to? Who should I switch to? I didn't see. I didn't see. Not that I know who it is anyway. Let me know. Let me know what to do. We're both, this is like, do you remember like Twitch plays Pokemon? Where everyone will like play Pokemon. This is like Stampy's chat plays Pokemon. If I could just like hand you the controller and let you just like vote on my inputs. It would absolutely do better. Uh, Inteleon? Inteleon? Inteleon! Okay. That's what most people seem to be, uh, seem to be saying. I will trust your guys' suggestions again. Then do I want to be using a water move then? It's fire poison, right? Let's use uh, let's use water then. They have a full six Pokemon here as well. We've got to be careful. Oh, I'd have never have used the water move. You guys are so good. Why have why have I been playing this like by myself with just little bits of hints? Why don't I do this every fight? Just let you tell me what to do. It's so much easier. I don't I don't I barely need to be here. I'm just like the middleman. I'm just the vessel for you guys to play. Oh, 120 attack. Um, use a round to the target. And no, no, this is just like a really strong move. Only 85 hit rate, so not the best. So that's 90. And I can use it 10 times as well. I might get rid of a uh, get rid of brick break. Should I though? Because I can only use that five times. I might get rid of first impression. Because we're awesome, says Shadow Ninja. You are awesome. Uh, oh, Tessarina. Tessarina. Right. <laughs> Who shall I switch to? <laughs> Help me out. Stampy, use Graph. F oh, no. I don't have a fire. You can't just say fire. I haven't got fire. It's, it's, so it's a grass type. Oh no, this is, once again, my lack of a fire Pokemon. So we need fire. Oh, I, oh, I, ice could do good against it. If, if I, oh no, if I stay out, they're going to hurt. I haven't got any other ice moves, do I? Oh, I could use freeze dry. Yeah, use tap out and use freeze dry. I need to get myself a fire, fire Pokemon. Before my next battle with squid and my, oh, hey squid. Do a poop, Squid says. Speaking of Squid, I didn't realize you're still here. I don't have a fire Pokemon and it keeps messing me up. But I'll, I'll get a fire Pokemon before we next battle, Squid. I should do good. Oh, there we go. That was pretty good. Pretty good. Pretty good. I just love that Pokemon. Look at him go. They should have a sound effect of like his, like his shoes. Like, as he's dancing. Thanos. I am Thanos. Me. I am Graf. <laughs> Where's the Graf starter? Grafium is a Graf type Pokemon. It should like... Oh, who do I want to switch to, by the way? It should like start off as like a pie chart and then like evolve into like a line graph. <laughs> <laughs> always going up, always going up. Maybe like it's a graph type Pokemon, and like the more you battle, like the more the graph goes up and its stats go up, the more you battle. I could come up with Pokemon. I could design that. Uh, keep Mr. Rhyme. You're saying it's a psychic type. Oh, I want to use a psychic type. Uh, let's let's let, uh, let's let buttons have a go then. Or are they gonna be uh they're gonna be dynamaxing now? Oh hello. So what I, I wanna use psychic? 
Are they going to Dynamax? I should probably Dynamax here, shouldn't I? Alright, let's hope I don't mess this up, because I always mess up when we get to Dynamaxing. Time to take out the trash. Garbador. Her Pokemon is actual garbage. Stamps, this is a stupid Pokemon. It's just a key. Also, Stamps, let's make a Graph Pokemon. Right, I'm not sure this is going to be effective. Let's see. Oh, don't kill me in one hit. Don't kill me in one hit. Thank you. Okay, I should at least be able to survive its hits until it gets small again. Then we can have, like, the, the fair fight. Oh! Was that super effective? It was super effective. Good old buttons. Speaking of um, adding like emotes and stuff, I've been thinking of uh, enabling memberships on the channel. Like one of my worries with it is I hate the idea that like, like if someone pays something, then they get something that other people don't get. Because some people don't have money, they can't afford that, or you know, like they just don't want to. But I was thinking maybe like, would, would people be annoyed if like you get them? Because I think you have to have emotes that you get. Would, would you mind of that? Like, I don't know. Like, I wouldn't want any exclusive videos that, like, are only... Or, like, any exclusive streams that you need to, like, be a paid member to watch. But I could maybe have, like, a private, like, Discord or something. Just to away... Because if I had a public one, it'd be, like, too many people to have conversations. So, yeah. I don't know. I'll think about it. I'll think about it. Like, it wouldn't affect the videos at all. It's just, like, I hate the idea it's, like... Like, it's aspirational to, like, you know, like, the fact that it's like, oh, I don't have this skin in Fortnite. I wish I could afford the skin, you know? No, no membership. Uh, Dan does it. It's fine. Yeah, like, it would never be anything, like, exclusive. But, yeah. It's just something like I've been thinking about. Like, I almost turned it on the other day, and then I backed out. <laughs> anyway, let's, uh, let's finish the game. Ah, oh, I wasn't able to win. Oh, Alina, you are really a hopeless woman. Oh, who's speaking? Oh, she talked to herself. <laughs> I feel like someone just came in and called her hopeless. Ah, this is inexcusable. What was I thinking? Any gym leader who's made uh, made it this far would be no pushover. Under normal circumstances, I would have tried to delay you further. However, all the necessary wishing stars have been collected. Do as you wish. There is nothing to be done now. Typical Stampy, you and Falcons are unstoppable. Yeah, you could have helped me drawing that, by the way, Hop. Everything I did, uh, I did to further the chairman's own goals. Leon, we've discussed this a hundred times already, and you still fail to understand what's at stake. You, who is supposed to be our champion. I think it's understand- uh, I think I understand well enough. What you don't understand is why we ought to cancel tomorrow's tournament in order to solve a problem that's a thousand years away from affecting any of us. What difference is one day going to make? My duty as chairman isn't this, this madness. It is to carry out the championship match. That's what Gala wants and what I want. It's what we've all been looking forward to for so long. No, you don't understand. You still don't understand a thing. Look around us, Leon. Look at the Gala region stretched out before us. And know that the energy required to keep this brilliant, glittering world alive will be exhausted a millennium from now. The people of Gala today will no longer even exist. What Gala wants today hardly matters. The future is more important than one that one day. Uh, we must act as quickly as we possibly can. We must go to the climate summit in Brussels. Oh, sorry. Uh, we must take action in order to avert tragedy so that all can look forward to a better future. 
In a thousand years? Fine. Look, I think I understand your concerns, Chairman. And I give my word that I'll help out with your plans just as soon as tomorrow's match is over. Lee, you never showed uh, when you were supposed to, so I got worried that something had happened. Piers and Marnie and all those Team Yells oddballs, they all helped us get here. I must apologise to you, Hop, if we've made you worry at all. Like, they were just standing there chatting during that whole Pokemon battle. They were like the giant Dynamax, like huge pile of trash. And they were just there like looking out the window and didn't even realise. <laughs> oh dear. Graph is the final boss. <laughs> Uh, anyway, sorry, what's going on? Uh, there are times when adults just can't seem to have an honest discussion with one another. Sometimes our pride just gets in the way. Never mind any of this, Hop and Stumpy. Let's head back to the hotel and we'll grab dinner together, yeah? It's on me, so you can order whatever you fancy. If you'll excuse us, Chairman Rose, uh, and I do hope you'll watch tomorrow's match. It's sure to be one for the history books. One for the history books. You still don't understand, young champion. We, no, I, am going to change the course of history. He's going to be a villain. He's going to think he's doing good, but he's going to be a villain. Something with those wishing stars and using Dynamax power or something. <laughs> the next evening. I'm just wrapping myself up in a blanket to get cosy. Put my slippers on. I just need a cup of tea and I'll be all set. Be all set. This is it. Did you get enough sleep? You and your team are the ones battling. But I've had uh, Butterfree... Uh, oh, I've had Butterfree in my stomach since I woke up. It's meant to be like butterflies in my stomach. <laughs> but Butterfree's in my stomach. Uh, Squid said, uh, I can't wait to stream a game after this with no dialogue. Oh my god, tell me about it, Squid. <laughs> Let's just let's just stream Tetris after this and just hum along to the music. Uh, let's just let's just skip through this. Blah 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 blah. If anyone wants to read it, you can like watch it back and watch it in slow motion. Because yeah, we got our battle against Leon coming up. Would you like me to show you the way to the stadium? Are you just gonna teleport me there? Don't mind that. So, are we battling him then? So apparently his Pokemon are all around like level 60. And mine aren't. <laughs> you may have noticed. <laughs> so where are rare candies and stuff? Are they in other items? Aha, uh -huh, rare candy. Uh, I guess I'll give this to Tapat. Boost them up a bit. I can give her an item to tap. Is there any like special item which is especially good with uh, with Tapat? Uh, we could do this just to put down their accuracy. Maybe make them miss. Oh, Choice Scarf. Is that good? It's actually like... Because it says it works with a particular Pokemon. Uh, you have a Fire Fox in the book. Yeah, Fire Fox just wasn't very strong for a Fire Pokemon. And they need a lot of leveling up it as well. I might be okay with... Um, uh, with a... Um, without a, uh, a Fire Pokemon. Just because I can use Ice moves. Uh, you aren't fighting, Leon. Spoilers... Spoilers, guys. Right, cheeky save. And let's go in and see whatever's going to happen. Battle Leon already. All right, calm down. I'm going, I'm going, I'm going. Stumpy! This is it. Uh, here at Windon Stadium. The greatest stadium in all of Gala. You're going to show everyone the greatest battle ever, mate. We set the world on fire. Go get yourself checked in. 
Right, probably buy like loads of potion and revives as well. End the stream here, says Mr. Banana. Why? Well, you're allowed to stop watching if you uh, if you want to. Is there not a shop here? I'll be fine. I don't need to buy any more potions. I got a dream ball. You must be tiring of doing that uh, the voice all day. <laughs> Oh my goodness, it's stampy. <laughs> oh, so we're going against gym leaders. Uh, we're going to do it? We're going we're gonna, to we're gonna do it now? Uh, save the game after the battles. That's what I did. Let's just do it. Let's just do it. Let's just do it. Probably not ready. Probably not leveled up enough. Gotta give it my best shot. So we're just gonna go against these guys again. I've already defeated all these guys. No, no, yes, yes. No, no, yes, yes. Graph. Get potions. Probably should have got some. Oh, there's a shop outside. Oh, too late. <laughs> can I, I don't think I can go back out now, can I? All right. Looks like the opening ceremony is gonna begin. I'm ready. Like, I'm not ready. But for the sake of the game, I'm ready. All right, wish me luck, everyone. I'm gonna need it. The chairman is tired of some business, so I hope no... In order to lead you all to the greatest heights as Pokemon trainers of the Gala region. The time has come for you to battle it out until only the greatest challenger remains. So on behalf of the chairman, allow me to say, let the finals matches Again! Who's that? Oh, BD's back. Good old BD. Couldn't stay away. A moment, if I may. No, kick him. Security! Does anyone here remember me? No! I am BD, the challenger who was forced to withdraw from the gym challenge. Baby, here's the challenger endorsed by Chairman Rose himself. I have a score to settle with challenger Stampy here. I'm aware that this is against the rule, but I must ask nonetheless. Let me battle him. I'll stake my career as a challenger in this battle. If I lose, I retire from being a trainer. What an unexpected turn of events. Former challenger Beady has come for one last battle. We are currently debating what to do with challenger Beady. Chuck him out. To all our viewers, both here and in the stadium and at home in front of the telly, we ask you to please be patient. I know this is ridiculous of me, but I have to say something. Do something. Ever since you showed up, everything I've done has gone wrong. It was Alina who asked me to gather the wishing stars for the chairman, but then the chairman himself disowned me. And then that strange old lady comes out of nowhere and drags me into a boot camp on fairy-type Pokemon. Do you have any idea what I've been through? Covered in pink? Dealing with quizzes and battles with fairy-type Pokemon every single day? And here I am, pouring my heart out to you, when I've never lost my cool before. We have reached a decision, ladies and gentlemen. The champion himself has accepted Beady's sudden interruption. Is the champion showing his love by giving every trainer a chance to grow stronger? Or is this the trial for challenger Stampy himself? My heart hasn't been broken yet. Are all of the uh, the lines on the uh, the ground in pink, just for the uh, the fairy type Pokemon? Uh, Samzy says, "Stampy, focus, okay, focus." Now you have got it. Thank you. And uh, Richard says, uh, "Hi, Stampy. Uh, my son and I are both huge fans. Uh, could you please say hi to my son, uh, Logan? Thanks, Stampy. You're the best. I can do that. Hi, Logan. Thanks for for watching the stream." Please uh, send me all of your luck through the screen because I am uh, probably, probably going to need it here. <laughs> I am woefully unprepared for this battle. Right, fairy type, fairy type. Let's get the graph out. Let's bring out, let's bring out uh, my graphian. <laughs> cut to, cut to graph cam. <laughs> right, uh, what do we, what do we want to do against fairy? We need poison, which I have none of, and steel, which I have none of. Great, brilliant. <laughs> I have no chance. Um... Let's just use, like, just strong moves. 
I don't actually do I, Oh no, I have one still move that um buttons knows. But it's not a very strong still move, and it's only one Pokemon. I don't know how far it's gonna get me. Oh. Um, okay. That did uh, that did not go very well. Yes, I don't have any. Yeah, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna have to, to keep using this steel wing move. April says, Stampy, I found a shiny graph. Oh, I'm jealous. I wish I could find a shiny graph. Uh, oh, it doesn't say super effective. Maybe that's not a full type fairy type. Fairy type? Where's steel? Steel. Steel should be good against. My graph says steel should be good against fairy type. And I live by the graph. Live by the graph, die by the graph. Oh god, they use a full restore, really? Uh, use fire type. I don't have a fire type Pokemon! You know that. Right, I think this is going to work with buttons. I think I need to use someone who can just use a stronger move. Maybe just like a stronger normal type move. Or maybe just electric. Let's just send Alex out. Thank you for uh, Pookingdale, Fox Spotter, for the uh, one pound donation. Welcome to the screen. Like, World Charge is just a really strong move, so hopefully that'll do okay. There we go. That went a little bit better. It is a Steel Fairy type. Ah, oh, that's why it wasn't very good. You should have prepared more. Yeah, well, Egg Peep. I asked people, should I prepare more or should I go in? And most people said just to go in. All right, who should I switch to? I'm going to have to, like... <laughs> I really need to, um... I need to play it safe. Who should I who should I use in this fight here? Should I bring buttons back out and just use um use my steel type? Oh po or oh, poison or ghost? Alright, let's um let's use ghost then. Let's let's uh, let's give Cuppa a go. Squid says use hero. Are you still here, Squid? Are you like are you popping in and out every now and then or are you are you sticking around? Because if you've not done this yet. Careful of spoilers. Careful of spoilers, Squid Nugget. There we go. Let's use Shadow Ball. Thanks for the suggestions, guys. That's a pretty move. Sometimes he says, luck, 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 luck. Sorry, that's all. Ah, oh, so close to getting him in one hit. That would have been great. Eat the graph and you will gain its power. Yeah, but then I'll lose my then I'll lose my graph. I need like one to eat and then one to one to look at. Uh, I'm about to send out Rapidash. Don't need, I got this one, guys. It's one of the uh, it's one of the starter gen Pokemon. I know it. <laughs> uh, I'm going to stop watching before the Leon battle. Uh, Nicole's uh, finished it before me, uh, so I've already been dodging all of the the spoilers. Like it's fine. Like you're welcome here, Squid. Hang out. Feel free. But yeah, I don't know if you heard what I said earlier. But I, I said we should have one final battle because we've won like one battle each. So when we're both like ready, like once we've both finished the game and got like our our ideal roster of Pokemon, then we should have one final battle for the decider for who's the Pokemon champion. The real like like the, the actual game doesn't really matter. I actually care more about being Squid than I do about finishing the actual game, just because I'm really competitive. <laughs> I didn't see who they're sending out. Right, who do I want to um, who do I want to use for for this one, guys? Uh, will you still do battles with fans? Yes, yeah, so I reckon I'll do once I finish the story. I'll probably do one final stream where I hopefully battle Squid and then just battle a um, a bunch of subscribers as well. Use the gra. Everyone's just saying the gra. Uh, sounds good. We will both have different legendaries too. Oh yeah, because you all have shield and I'll have sword. Uh, use tapat. A lot of people are saying. 
Okay, Tapper. Your time to dance. Well, thank you, SA, for the donation. Uh, I live in New York, and I have watched your videos and squid since I was nine. I am now 18 and graduated. <laughs> Thanks for watching for so long, and congratulations on your, your graduation. Uh, oh, yeah, so do, do I want to use psychic moves? Is that, is that the plan here? Oh, hello, Squishy. Squishy's in the chat as well. Everyone say hello to Squishy. Oh, are they on their final Pokemon then? Are we in uh, Dynamax territory? <laughs> what is that Pokemon? <laughs> it looks like the, um, you know, the little, you, you know, if you've seen Men in Black 1, you know, like the little alien who's like inside the person's head. He's like, Orion, like, it, like it's on Orion's belt or whatever. <laughs> it looks like that when Pokemon form. Oh, this is gonna hurt, isn't it? No! <laughs> right, do I want to send out buttons now then and Dynamax? I guess I want to use Psychic, is that right? Do I want to use Psychic? Do I want to use Psychic? Don't use Psychic! Don't use Psychic! Uh, oh, Ghost and Psychic. Don't use Psychic. So what what are what are they? What do I want to use? I don't even know what they are. Are they, are they psychic? If they're psychic. I want to use oh bug, ghost, or dark. Is that right? I guess use copper. Right. Put my Dynamax in. And use uh, Max Darkness. Use the Graph. They're a Psychic Fairy. Got to attack first. Please be good. Please be good. Please be good. No. Should I use ghost? Hopefully I survived this. I wasn't fully healed up. No. Oh, we're in trouble, guys. We are in trouble. Oh, no. They are graph type. I'm in trouble here. I'm in big trouble. So I don't have any other ghost type. Don't use the graph. Use the chart. Use bug? Does that, does that work? I think I'll be okay once it goes small. Use steel? Alright, I guess two days I might be able to start using some... Um, Uh, I might be able to start using some revives if need be. But it looks like I might need to. Use dark. No, dark, dark didn't work. Dark, dark wasn't, like, effective. Okay, they've gone small again. Hopefully I'll be able to finish them off now they're small. So what do I want to use? Steel? Let's just use rock and just hope it just does normal damage. This isn't good, I know. Oh, that hardly did anything. Put myself up a little bit though. You steal? I should you steal? You steal? I don't have any ghost. My ghost, my ghosts are down. Let's okay. Let's let's listen to you. Are you steal? Yeah, I think that did good. Woo! That was close. That was scary. 
Squatch said I'm in my pajamas now. I got acne cream on. I'm not going to stream with over 2,000 <laughs> viewers. <laughs> I couldn't win, but at least I was able to show everyone how great fairy types are. All of that, all of that kind of comeback for revenge, and I just win. That was scary close, though. And if Leon is way stronger than BD, I might be in trouble, guys. Big trouble. Well, I lost. And it looks like Challenger BD was no match for Challenger Stampy and his trusted team. Hey, BD! That was some match! Is that what the audience shouted? Like, all of the audience shout that in perfect unison. Is that like a chant? Hey, BD, that was some match. Hey, BD, that was some match. Is that what they're chanting? <laughs> Don't retire! Don't retire! Restart your career! Restart your career! Don't retire! <laughs> How is the audience shouting? Is it like just a person in the audience or all of them? But, but, this isn't what I planned. I planned to win. If I was able to destroy you, then everything would be fine. Even if I lost, I was going to uh, use uh, retiring as an excuse to get away from that old lady. <laughs> the lady keeps dressing him up in pink. You just keep messing up my plans. With everyone cheering me on like this, I have no choice but to continue my training as the fairy type gym leader. Though I suppose with my talents I'll be able to overtake this Opal in no time. The stadium is filled with voices cheering on these two young trainers. Now, Challenger Stampy, please head back to the locker room so you can rest up from that unexpected match. Rather surprising for Challenger BD to barge in like that. Yeah, where was the security? In any case, once you're ready, please head to the pitch. Right, I should be all, um... Should be all healed up. All healed up. Cheeky save time. Gotta have our cheeky save. I don't know why they keep sending... I can't, I've got nothing to do here, do I? Should we go back in? Right, back in. <laughs> that was fun. Rested up. And I'm ready! Ta da! Right, let's go. The time for waiting is over! The finals of the Champion Cup are about to begin! The two trainers to face each other in the first battle for the first round are a trainer endorsed by the champion himself, Challenger Stampy! And his opponent, the Raging Wave, the Master of Water Types, Nessa! Stampy, have you trained the chat so they always ask me to make you tea? I haven't! That's all of them! That's what they said! But if you are making tea... <laughs> my cup's here. So's yours. I can tell you've grown far stronger since you uh, faced you in Holbury Stadium. I've got to hand it to our undefeated champion. He's got a proper eye for talent too. But you're not the champion and you'll never become the champion either. So <laughs> do you know why? It's because I, Nessa, I'm going to defeat both you and... Yeah, yeah, blah, blah, blah. I'm the best, I'm the best. Oh, you battled hard and you showed me a good fight and you won. Yes, that's the way it always goes. I'm too sleepy to make tea, Soz. Squishy. You really want everyone to see me cry on stream? So I will cry if I don't get tea. That's the way it works. Right, so she's meant to be water type, right? I should do okay against water type. I've got Alex. He's pretty good. I don't have any grass type Pokemon either. I've, I've, I've got, I haven't got any grass or, um, or fire type Pokemon, do I? Okay, I didn't do very good. Put their defense down at least. Let's try this move. This move moves new, isn't it? Mega Horn. Oh, they're switching out. I scared them off. Hello. <laughs> Hello, Pelly Pepper. Should I just switch to Alex now? 
Oh, actually, your rock slide is super effective. Use electric? Yeah. I will use a... Uh, as soon as this is effective anyway, I can... Oh, no way! Whoa, 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 whoa! That was not in the plan. Okay, I'll switch to, to Alex now. Uh, they're only level 51. Spark should be enough to finish them off. I won't use Wild Charge just because it damages me as well. Oh no! Then they use a full restore. I hate it when you get to like these end battles and they start using like healing Pokemon as well. Oh, was, hey, that was good. I was still able to like one shot them. Stampy, you make tea for Squashy. I probably will. I do usually. I do make like 95% of the uh, <laughs> the tea in the, the house. Just means I'll have to like pause the uh, the stream for a bit. <gasps> La soup! No, sorry, this is Grande La soup. <laughs> for those that have no idea what I'm on about, I used to have this Pokemon and I called it La soup, and then it evolved and I called it Grande La soup. Oh, hello Sage, welcome back. Uh, by the way, our biscuits with Grazy are like bread rolls and flaky. If you need an image, look on uh, KFC, uh, KFC biscuits. I tried looking for an emoji, but there was none. Yeah, people tweeted me, like, showing me American biscuits. They look a almost a little bit like uh, Yorkshire puddings. If you look at what a Yorkshire pudding is. And that's something you normally have with, like, gravy, with, like a roast or something. It's almost like a, um, like a pastry bowl that you put, like, gravy and, like, you put your food into. Which is, like, an English thing. Shout out to, uh, oh! Pukendale Fox Potter again. Welcome back. No, not dippy, but they're like big. They're like puffy, squishy. The so, so look at American biscuits. Has Alex got one health left? Is that, did I see that right? I think I'm going to keep him out, but I'm going to heal him up. Because they're gonna they're gonna Dynamax now. Is it was it this guy again? Is that is that her last Pokemon? Uh, I've lost track. Oh no, she's got one more after that, and then she's gonna Dynamax. Oh, I really want tea now. Why do people start mentioning tea? Oh, that's all I want to do. All right after this battle, I'm gonna go make tea. <laughs> Thanks for the uh, donation, David. Right, I've got to be careful here because they're going to Dynamax. But I'm still like a little bit weak. What I might do is I might send out a... I'm going to send out Tapat as a... Um, as a... Um, as a tribute. <laughs> as like a donation. And so I'm going to leave Tapat out while I heal Alex. Tapat will get destroyed... Then I'll send out Alex and Dynamite Alex. Just to play it safe. Just because I've been struggling with these fights. I'm just going to play it as safe as I can. Oh, actually, Freeze, freeze Dry is super effective. Tell you what, let's Dynamax tap out. Change of plan. Change of plan. Max Hellstorm. From the dancing top hat legend himself. Mr. Tap out. I can't wait to see a giant dancing tap. Gonna be shaking the stadium as he tap dances. Like, <laughs> you don't have to make me tea, Squishy. It's fine. I'll go make tea. I'll have a quick break. Like a five minute break, and I'll make a cup of tea. And take Alex out. <laughs> ugly Blastoise gets extra ugly when he's, uh, when he's blown up huge. Max Hellstorm Storm is not very effective. It isn't effective. Oh. Well, who cares? We get to see this beautiful sight. Oh, look at him! Oh, he's so happy and enormous. Look at him dancing! He looks like a float in a parade. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Please don't kill me in one hit. Oh, ooh, okay. I'm alive. I survived a hit. Oh, their move was super effective against me as well. Uh, Eve says favorite tea flavor. Like, I'm just a, a classic English breakfast kind of guy. Oh, I did nothing. Did nothing. Oh, but look how happy he is. 
Right, let's so let's just heal up. Um, let's just heal up Alex then. And just be ready to use Alex. Once the uh, <laughs> once Tafat's taken out, at least you get to see him dancing. This is terrifyingly cool. It is. We actually, um, we were playing board games last night and we were taking it turns to choose songs. And this is one of the songs I chose. One of the, uh, the gym music songs. It's so epic. Didn't even need the Dynamax. Didn't even need the Dynamax. All right, I defeated Nessa. So yeah, I'm gonna have a very quick break. Uh, just about like five minutes or so. And then we're gonna carry on making our way through the, the challenge. Uh, so yeah, uh, I won't be too long. Like literally, I'll probably be less than five minutes. So just make a cup of tea, turn my dog toilet, and then we'll continue where we left off. So uh, if people are coming in the chat and they're asking what's going on, just let them know I'll be back soon. Uh, but yeah, I will be back soon. Bye.
Banana. Hello, guys, everyone. Welcome back to the stream. Like, I think I think I was like literally five minutes. Was that like more than five minutes? Like, I was the speed in which it takes for my kettle to boil. I reckon that was about dead on five minutes, if you scroll back. Everyone's like, oh, I thought it was going to be five minutes, not five years. I wasn't that long. Like, the kettle doesn't take that long to boil. And I took Alex out into the garden as well. Made myself a lovely fresh cup of Sinus tea. <laughs> uh, just before I left, Dino said, um, American biscuits are like scones. Uh, just like more savory. Uh, and usually made with buttermilk. Okay, I'm starting to understand your your weird biscuits, America. America and their weird biscuits. <laughs> Alright then, so uh, we just beat, beat Nessa uh, before I before I left. We had, we had four, 400 people backed out during the, uh, the Be Back Soon stream. But that's okay. More people will jump in and, uh, and join in with, uh, with some of the, the fun. All right, then. Let's, uh, let's carry on going through these challenges. You had no problem handling my surging might. <laughs> uh, it's no wonder that you won. Everyone's so confident, aren't they? Hello, Sticky Boy Tom. Thanks for the uh, £2 donation. And the winner is... Stumpy! He defeated Nessa during the gym challenge and now he's poured it off again! You and your Pokemon are just too much. Even with my Dynamax partner, you weathered our waves and stood firm. Now that I think about it, Sonya was saying something about how amazing you were. I wish I'd paid more attention to what she was talking about. I bet everyone in Gala's got their eyes on you now. Yeah, I've literally never lost. You defeated my team, so now you've got to ride that current all the way to the end. Now, don't go anywhere, ladies and gentlemen. The second battle of the first round will begin shortly. Ah, so here's the uh, the tournament structure. So I am going to be going up against, uh, oh, Bay, Bia, Bia, Bay, Bia, 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 Bea, Bia. That's not a name, is it? So I'm going to go against them. And then I'm going to either be going up against Piers or uh, Relhan in the uh, the final round. So it means I'm going to be going up against a uh, fighting type uh, in my next round. Uh, you should get some revives. Uh, it's too late. There's no. Sh I can't go to the shop anymore, can I? I'm like stuck here. So, yeah, I would get more revives, but I can't. So everyone should be healed up, which is good. All right, let's uh, check uh, my Graphion, and uh, let's see. Uh, let's see what's going to be uh, good against fighting type. So, uh, flying, uh, psychic, and fairy. Oh, this is good because I have. Two psychic Pokemon. So let's uh let's save buttons. Let's go straight out with Tapat. And then we'll have a uh back up with buttons <laughs> in case things don't go wrong. Of course, before we jump in, I need to have myself a little cheeky save, as I uh, so often do. Uh, and then we'll be uh, ready. Uh, yeah, ready for the uh, the next battle. A uh, donation is coming from uh, from Jaden. Uh you have uh you have to have uh Roy Boss T and Rusks. Uh, South African... Oh! Rooibos tea and rusks. Rooibos tea. I don't know what that is. I might look into it, though. If there's, like, a new type of tea that I don't know about, I need to stay up with my, uh, my tea facts. Ladies and gentlemen, we're already at the second match of the finals. Of the four remaining challengers, which two will be left for this last match? If you're just tuning in, ladies and gentlemen, we witnessed quite a surprise during the finals here last year's Champion Cup as the former gym challenger BD stormed the stage, but Stampy was having none of it. This year's top challenger made quick work of him before washing away gym leader Nessa. On the other side, we have Gala Karate Prodigy. Let's hear it for gym leader Bua. Everybody. <laughs> I don't know how to say her name. Heck, does that, can anyone like write out like phonetically how to pronounce her name? Is it is it beer beer, bear bear, maybe bear? I promise you, my attacks will shake your very soul. May the best trainer win. Oh god, I like that. Short and sweet to the point. She didn't need to do like a, a giant. Oh, just B, just pronounce B. Okay. I was overcomplicating it. Right then, B. Why don't you buzz off before I sting you, huh? Uh, Humblebee says, uh, there's more story after you beat the champion. Go to the slumbering yield. Ah, oh, so is that going to be where I go to, to capture the legendary Pokemon? 
So I want to use psychic moves, right? Then again, they look like they're flying as well. So freeze dry could actually do pretty good against them as well, maybe. Nice job, Tap Hat. They're going to level up soon as well, because they're like my my lowest level Pokemon. Sir Fetched. Oh yeah, this is where I messed up before, because I tried to bring out Alex, because I thought there'd be like a flying Pokemon. But they weren't counted as a, as a flying Pokemon, were they? Or were they not type? No, I think they maybe they were, but they weren't counted as a grass Pokemon. There was something weird about Sir Fetched, and I ended up getting it wrong before. Well, this one's going. This one's a bit easier. Lost stamps. Now you must finish the game. Well, I put. I was so sure I was going to finish the game in this stream. I'm getting a bit worried now because <laughs> the game keeps just not ending, making uh, pretty speedy progress in uh, against B here, though. Oh, hello, hello, stranger. They got their own wiggly worm. Is this going to be like the easiest fight ever? And are we going to see Dynamax Tapat again is the question. Or do we uh, or do we Dynamax Buttons this time? Just for a bit of variety. Stampy serious mode. I'm just happy to be doing good for once. <laughs> it hasn't been happening much. I might send out Buttons just for safety. Just because he's higher level and a bit stronger. And we've already had our, we've had our fun with our dancing Tapat. Yeah, let's uh, let's have buttons have a go. Let's have a little bit of variety. Like for some, like we've had some really tough fights here, but now this is like a uh, like this is probably like the easiest gym fight I've had, and this is like the semi-finals as well. We're only one fight away from the final, and then who whoever I beat in the final, do I then go up against Leon? Is that the way this is going to work? All right, then, Machamp, bring it on. Max Mindstorm. Grid says, I'm back. Have you lost yet? No, I've just been like one hitting my whole way through this fight against B. And I had a quick break in when I made myself a cup of tea as well. This is like uh, live streaming with old man Stampy. I'm like, here, like sitting here in my little blanket with my cup of tea. <laughs> Playing my little Pokemon game. Well then, kids. Let's see what's going on with those video games. I actually got a chance to one-hit them here. Oh no, they're attacking first. Oh, please don't do too much damage. Yeah. That's okay. I think worst comes to the worst. I could survive three of them in a row. He's not that close to the end. I'd say another 90 minutes left? Like an hour and a half? Yeah, we're probably not going to finish the game today, guys. I think I may have mistitled this stream. Report me for clickbait. <laughs> yeah. I thought I was going to. So I just like change it. So I just add like an in brackets, maybe. There you go. Finishing the game, maybe. If you uh, if you refresh the the stream, it sh you should see uh, see it's been uh, it's been updated. Welcome back. Who's returning after my break? All you've missed is me absolutely destroying B. Stampy, chill on the clickbait. 
You'll never guess what happened in Pokemon Sword. <laughs> Stumpy tells the truth about Pokemon Sword. Then the thumbnail is just me crying. <laughs> Your strength nearly made me want to turn and run it in my bare feet. <laughs> yeah, just, just a Pokemon battle. Calm down, B. B has, B has been defeated. Challenger Stumpy has shown his skill. Thank you for a wonderful match. I like her because she doesn't chat for ages. I, <clears throat> I really enjoyed battling you and your team. I'm upset that I lost, but I also feel so satisfied and refreshed. In a way, I guess you could say it was the best sort of match anyone could hope for. I mean, it was a bit better for me because I won. <laughs> I mean, you're putting on a, on a bright face, but still. Uh, I hope that you'll meet many more trainers uh, and have many more matches in the future. And I hope that every one of those encounters will nourish your spirit. The next match will begin in no time. Stay, uh, so stay in those seats, folks. Uh, right, so I'm going against Rehan. So what type is he? Is, oh, is he dragon type? Right? Is it dragon type next? Uh, sis, you shouldn't be for- Oh, what's going on? Sorry, Stampy. I thought my bro could get revenge for me, but he lost to Ray uh, Rayhan. Uh, you look so sloppy out there that people are going to think that we're both weak because we're related. You got it wrong, sis. Rayhan's just that strong. But I was able to show everyone in the audience how amazing a proper battle with him uh, using Dynamax could be. Uh, Alright, I get it. But that's exactly why I wanted to win. I still thought it was a brilliant battle though. I'm counting on you to win, Stampy. Got that? I'll be cheering for you. Sorry to come in for a chinwag just before the final match. Ray has waiting for you on the pitch. We're looking forward to a right good battle. Right, is he, dra is he dragon type? Is that right? Is he dragon? Is he dragon? Is he dragon? Oh, hello. Hello. There we go. That's the one. Is he dragon? Yes, he's dragon. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, there's a delay in the chat <laughs> for, for when you were answering. Uh, so I need to use ice, dragon, or fairy. I have no fairy. I have no dragon. I have very few ice moves. Uh... This this fight might be oh so oh he he is ice. Should we uh oh is this gonna be another another tap out special? <laughs> I love every time I use the graph, everyone please uh everyone please spam the uh the, the graph emote <laughs> every time I need to use the graph. Right, cheeky save! Cheeky 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 save, and then we will uh we will jump back in. Yeah, I think this might be another tap out special. This is going to be the toughest fight yet. I really don't have anything good to, to go up against them. Who will earn the right to challenge the unbeatable champion Lee? Will it be the brilliant rising star, challenger Stampy? Or will it be the only trainer that champion Leon calls his rival? The tamer of dragons, Kali- sorry, uh, Rayhan. Uh, Dog Whip says, Stampy, will you make a Pokemon Nuzlocke? I don't know what that is. Oh, is that what you like combine two Pokemon to make a special one? I'd love to do that. I don't know where to do it. If anyone knows how I do that, uh, let me know. Uh, you're really something else, kid. You've made it all the way here. I guess that's why the champion himself endorsed you, yeah? Leon's my rival and he chose you. So I've got to prove myself that I'm better and that I can beat him. I've reworked my whole team and now we're really, really good. Anyway, you think you can beat me, but you can't because the gym challenge, no regrets, blah, 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 blah. Let's fight. Yeah, how, how do I do the Nozlocke? I've just sat down to have a have a poop. Uh, entertain me. Well, the thing is, I think that this battle might be too stressful for you, Squid, if you're pooping. And I don't want you to clench. I need you to relax. So maybe I just this will be like a relaxed battle and I'll try and help you out. Because that's what friends are for. Uh, a Nuzlocke is when all the, the grass... Yeah, how do I do the Nuzlocke? Because I know there's a... Um, I, I know there's a thing where you like combine two Pokemon to make a special Pokemon. Um... Maybe that isn't Nuzlocke. Maybe I was thinking of something else. But I know that is a thing where you can do that. But I haven't done it yet. I don't know if I've missed it. Or whether it's just something that you can only do at the end of the game. Oh, that wasn't very effective. That wasn't very effective at all. I thought Ice is supposed to be good against Dragon. Is that not full Dragon? Is that like a Fire Dragon? What should I do, guys? Guys, what do I do? Tell me what to do. 
What do I do? What do I do? Do I do I battle? Do I switch Pokemon? That's not a Nuzlocke. Oh, I was getting confused. Uh, that's just Fire type. Have I got anything to go good against Fire? Oh yeah, I got Water, don't I? Duh! Stampy, Stampy, Dum Dum. All right, let's switch out. This is going to hurt, I think. Shout out to, to Fred. Thanks for the uh, the donation. Shout out to uh, Victor Libert uh, as well. Says they've been watching me since they're a kid and they're now an adult and they have a kid of their own. That is crazy. Well, that didn't go very well, did it? Um, I guess I could use ground or... I don't think I got ground or rock. Oh, button those rock slide? Let's try buttons. There we go. Right. You might have to, to let me know who to switch to here. So I don't want to I knew this was going to be a tough fight and I don't want to lose it. Flygon. I mean, that sounds like a flying Pokemon. Should I be using Alex here? If it's a dragon type, I could use an ice move. I could put out Tapat again. Oh no, because Inteleon, they have ice as well, but they're fainted. Oh, use Alex? Tapat? Most people are saying Tapat. It is not flying type, it's dragon. Okay. I might at some point have to try and use a revive on uh, Inte Inteleon. Or Inteleon, whatever it is. Just to get the, uh, the ice move back. There we go. Freeze dry, super effective. Thank you guys! Thanks for the assistance! E even with my graph, it's not enough. Nice! Couldn't have done it without- I would have sent out Alex if I hadn't have asked you. Ooh, that's not super effective. Oh, fire and dragon. Right, I might try and uh, revive into Leon now then. Let's see how much damage this just does. I did okay, actually. See if I got a full revive. I don't know if I should save that for when I go up against Leon. I've only got six normal revives as well. <laughs> Have a taste of a sunny day. <laughs> Not a sunny day. Right, let's just set him up, so we're going to want him to be Dynamax at the end as well. Sage says, you and Squid should make another food video. We have spoke about it. we're just not, like, together very often. And to, like, to do that, we kind of need to be in person.
Fagudra. Right, who should I uh, switch to for Fagudra? Anyone know? Ice? Pure dragon? Just ice? Right. Papek can stay in then. Keep his dance. I just, just really might need a bit of a break. Oh, hello. I mean, they're really cute, but then they got like horrible like mucus or something dripping from them. <laughs> Still pretty cute though. Right, this is going to be the last Pokemon we do normally. And then the, the last one is going to be Dynamax time. And then I'll probably switch to Interleon then. Now they're like fully healed up. Gudra. <laughs> It's so hot, I, uh, I hate the dripping. I don't want to look at it. I didn't actually do that good damage against them. It's so super effective, but it's just not the strongest ice move in the world. It's acid, not mucus. I mean, hey, all I can do is see it. I can't touch it or smell it, and it looks like, it looks like mucus. <laughs> And to be fair, acid isn't much better. <laughs> Use fire or ground for Gigamax? Uh, get Tapat to learn Ice Beam. Yeah, that'd be good. I don't think I've got the uh, the TM for Ice Beam, but Ice Beam's really strong. Like all of like the beam moves are strong. I forgot that Fairy's good against Dragon as well. I forgot that, um, well, I forgot that Alex had his one little Fairy move. I could Dynamax Alex, you know. Uh, let's keep, uh, let's keep Alex out. Is this okay? Should I Dynamax Alex? Oh, the music's hotting up. No, not Alex. Yes, Alex. No, Alex. Dynamax Alex. Bad idea. Giant Alex, yay. Yeah, why not? All right, no, everyone's disagreeing. Oh, no, it doesn't say it's very effective, Play Rough. Okay, I won't Dynamax Alex. Alex will probably get taken out here. He'll be healed, he'll be healed up soon enough. Dynamax the doggo! Oh, it's this guy again, the skyscraper Pokemon. Alex survived that? Good boy. I thought Alex was going to get taken down in one hit. It's good because even though Alex is going to get taken out. Alex is a girl. Yeah, I know, but like, everyone says good boy, don't they? That's like the saying. <laughs> ah, so not very effective. But is Wiggly Worm good? Ah, so fighting moves are going to be good. All right, so we're going to have a, a Dynamax Wiggly Worm. Alex is a girl. I know Alex is a girl. Like actual Alex. 
But everyone always says, like, you know, it's a good boy when it's the dawn about dogs. No? Can I not save myself? Right, we should destroy them here. I reckon this is going to be a one hit. <laughs> oh, that's a great one. I'm glad we got to see this. Wiggly Worm's a beast as well. You can't even see like that. How far, like, is the back one like going into the crowd? Look how long it is. Ha. Max Knuckle. That's terrifying. I wouldn't want to be in the front row if I was watching this. Nice! Right, that should be us um, going to battle Leon now then. Losing in the finals is pretty rough, but I suppose I better take a quick shot to remember it by. Because he's like taking a selfie. <laughs> Challenger Stampy seizes victory! My lovely Pokemon and I have become much stronger than we were before. You just blew right past us, beyond anything I'd imagined. I'm still uh, pretty young myself. But it just goes to show you that there's always someone younger coming up, reaching further than you ever dreamed. And you've got your whole future ahead of you. Keep up the momentum. Prove that Leon is not unbeatable. Number 117, Challenger Stampy has achieved a dazzling triumph. The trainer who was endorsed by the champion will now face the very man who endorsed him. Right, the unbeatable champion. Let's go up against Leon. All right, the big moment's finally here, eh? I just came to cheer you on, you know? It's still not easy picking sides. After all, it's the showdown between my big brother and my rival. Who should I really want to win more? Uh, your brother? Right, you reckon I should cheer for Stampy too, don't you? Couldn't agree more. After all, we did start this thing together way back in Potswick. So... Uh, so you better beat Lee, you hear? If anyone can beat the unbeatable champion, it'll be you, mate. <laughs> Flash! <laughs> oh, well, thank you for the, uh, the donation, uh, Vivian Simpson. For the, the £15 donation. Thank you so much. With uh, the message saying, this is what you deserve. Don't know about that, but yeah, thank you so much. And then, uh, oh... <laughs> Followed up with a st donation from Stampy Longbow. <laughs> okay. Um, well, I don't know what, what Pokemon he's going to have. Like, who should we start off with? Maybe, um... Let's leave Tapper out to start with. Just because I have two Psychic Pokemon. So then that way, if he gets taken out, I still have buttons. We'll have ourselves a little cheeky save. Then we're going face down against uh, against Leon. There he is. <laughs> his his grin. Right, the unbeatable, hopefully not for long, Leon. Uh, the tents still air on the pitch. The exact opposite from the audience cheering and yelling. They're both fantastic, wouldn't you say? But remember, the audience is also a bit cruel. They want nothing more than to see one of us play Terraria. Sorry, one of us to lose after all. Uh, it can fill you with fear knowing that, uh, but I absolutely love pushing past the fear. I uh, love giving it everything I've got as a trainer and seeing my team give everything they've got to seize another victory. It's the greatest feeling in the world, and I can't get enough of it. I can feel my partners itching with anticipation inside their Pokeballs. We're going to have a real champion time. I'm the Gala Regions, uh, Regions champion, Leon. Me and Chauzard and the rest of our team will use all our knowledge and experience to crush you completely. Wow. Thanks, Leon. 
Hi, we're gonna crush you completely. Good luck. <laughs> uh, wait, hold on, says the audience in perfect unison. Hey, says all of the audience. Look at the monitor. What is that on the big screen? Oh, it's Rose. Hello there, Leon and Stampy. Just letting you know... I think it's time I brought about the darkest day, for the sake of Gala's future, of course. But I'm in a bit of a pickle. The energy released by the darkest day is too much for us to contain. Okay. This doesn't look good. I'm sorry it's come to this, but it's you who forced my hand, Leon. You refuse to listen. I want a battle! Lee! Stampy! That video stream! It was from Hammerlock Stadium, right? What in the world did the chairman do? I don't know, but everything he was saying yesterday. Did he really pull this crazy stunt to solve some problem a thousand years in the future? I've got to see what's going on. I'm the champion. I have to go. I should have realized what the champion intended to do before it came to this. I'll take responsibility now for fixing this mess. This is the real champion time. But Lee, you're terrible at directions. What if you get lost along the way? <laughs> uh, best recurring joke in a video game ever. I want to help my brother, Stampy. But I've got to, but I can't even imagine, uh, I can't even manage to beat you. So what sort of help could I be? Uh, they're always so, they're always just the same. Why even let me pick? Like, why, why, there should just be one option of like, you would be no help. <laughs> just try. But what? What can I even do? Hold the phone. The chairman was talking about the darkest day. That's the thing with the sky went all dark once, ages and ages ago, right? What does he mean? It's bringing that about. And where did we even hear that name? Uh, back in Motorstoke. The statue of the hero in Motorstoke? Sonia said something about it then, didn't she? Even though it turned out to be wrong, since there were actually two heroes and all that. Still, those two managed to bring an end to the darkest day with the sword and shield Pokemon. Sonia thought the Pokemon might still be sleeping somewhere though, right? We should try to find them, Stampy. But where to start looking? The Slumbering Wield? That's it, Stampy! I'm sure it's got to be in the Slumbering Wield. That illusion you tried to fight off that day. It must have been one of the Pokemon that are supposed to be sleeping there. Let's go back to the Slumbering Wield. If we're lucky, we'll find something that uh, we can do to help. Uh, Cameron Wilcox. Thanks for the donation and the all caps message followed by lots of exclamation marks just saying play Terraria. Sorry, that I've just never heard of it. I'm not sure what not sure, not sure what a uh, not sure what a Terraria is, to be honest. Is that some sort of creature? Is that a Pokemon? If I see a Terraria, I try and capture one though. Sounds good. Huh? Stampy and Hop? Oh, I completely forgot about the championship match. What are you two doing here? Haven't you been watching the news at all? The tournament is off, Sonia. The chairman saw to it, uh, and uh, sure to that, and to sending the entire region into a state of havoc. Huh? What? <laughs> what happened while I was researching things in the slumbering world? Well, for starters, there's a great black storm or something raging over Hammerlock Stadium. They're calling it the darkest day. It's thrown everything into disarray. Still, I'm not. Sh I'm sure we don't need to worry too much about it. The unbeatable champion will be able to take care of everything, won't he? Hold on a tick, Mum. Did you say the darkest day? The darkest day is the name for the black storm that nearly brought the Gala region to ruin in ancient times. So, what are you here for, Stampy? Uh, search for the sword Pokemon. I suppose if the legends are true, then the sword Pokemon and shield should be able to prevent the darkest day from coming to pass. They may be just what we need to beat back the Black Storm. Okay, here, take this. You should head to the Slumbering Wield. I'll catch up with you once I'm done looking into something that's been bothering me. You obtained three, Max. Oh, very helpful. Doesn't it feel like ages ago when we started back here and the, uh, the Wooloo was there, like, smashing into the, the fence? Doesn't that feel like so long ago? All that matter... Oh. 
Sorry, wait. What was her voice again? I can't remember what her voice was. I'll just do a different voice. No, that matters. Is that you do what you can? You've become a five point trainer after all. I'm your mum. Uh, Say says you should review the app Minecraft Earth. I don't think it's fully out yet. I think it's just like in beta. Uh, Squishy's been been playing it though. Squishy, how's how's Minecraft Earth? Have you kept playing it? Thumbs up, thumbs down. Like I think I think she played it for one day. I don't know if she's carried on playing it. Uh, yeah, but I I've not really played it properly yet. Pro properly yet. Ready for this, Stampy? I wonder if we're about to head straight into a wall of fog again. Not that it would bother us now. We've both grown loads stronger and have so many more Pokemon. Going into the forest after Wooloo that day, that was the start of everything, wasn't it? A legendary beginning, really. I reckon whatever we're about to see will be pretty legendary itself. It's head in and add other pages to our tale. And I meant to get like a master ball. Like, can I capture this guy? Am I going to be alright capturing it with an ultra ball? Uh, it's really good. Uh, but it makes her phone explode a bit. <laughs> is the, the review. I got like 29 ultra balls. Alright, let's head in. But before we do, I'm going to have a cheeky save. Yeah, I'm not really much interested in uh, Minecraft Earth. I just couldn't be bothered to gather materials on it. I just want to go like, I hate like having my phone out when I'm walking. I don't want to be like bringing it up and tapping. Oh, they're already weak, aren't they? Level two. Let's just run. There's no point in fighting these guys, is there? Uh, you won't catch. Is it, is it impossible to catch it? Yeah, it's worth letting me know if it is because it, if it isn't impossible to catch, if it is impossible to catch, I won't try. But otherwise, I'll keep trying to, to capture it. So if I can't capture it now, just let me know. And I just won't bother. Uh, I don't catch it now. You can catch it. Okay. We need a more definitive answer. <laughs> if, if anyone else knows, add your opinion and we'll see what the majority is. <laughs> you can't catch it. You get it later? Impossible. You catch it later. Okay, can't catch it now. Can catch it later. Got it. Is this going to be a high level one? It is. Level 46. Thank you for letting me know, chat. I might as well do some of these fights. Just because apparently Leon's Pokemon are all around like level 60. And I'm uh, a little bit under leveled right now. Not too bad. But I'm still a little bit weak. So it'd be good to uh, to take out a few people. A few Pokemon, I guess, I should say. If I find any uh, fire Pokemon, it might be good to, to catch them. Because that's the, the one big thing that my uh, my Pokemon ro roster is lacking. I don't know if there's any uh, fire Pokemon in these woods. But if you see one and I miss one, or if you know of one that is in this woods, let me know. What's with this fog? It's even worse than the first time we came here. Oh, we found it. Oh, they're both here. Oh, that's good. You don't need. I don't need to buy both games. Look at that. Got both of them. Lord, Grrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrr
You must have seen that, right? Those, those sword and shield Pokemon. They were right in front of us. But they disappeared into the forest. Hop, are you sure you haven't lost the plot? There was never anyone here but you two. What? Then were those just illusions or something? Listen, I dug into some literature from the other regions and I finally found something. Mentions of the sword Pokemon, Zakane, and the shield Pokemon, Zamanzenta. The writings said that those two Pokemon were born somewhere beyond the slumbering world. Long, sometime long, long ago. In a galaxy far, far away. Did, did they really? Ta, Sonya. Thanks for digging into it. Even if it is just an illusion or whatever, we did manage to find the Pokemon again. Maybe the sword and shield that those two used uh, to carry are still here too. Oh, this looks like a place to find legendary Pokemon. Everyone just joining in the stream, welcome. We are going after the legendary Pokemon to stop the darkest day, whatever that is, which Rose is doing. Would you take a look at that, Stampy? Now that's something you don't see every day. This place definitely feels like the stuff of legend. It's good the story's actually finally getting a bit more interesting now. Because the story hasn't been great up until now. But this bit's quite fun, isn't it? Like, what's going on with the darkest day and what's Rose trying to do? It's quite fun. Like, I've always enjoyed the gameplay and the battling and capturing Pokemon. But the story hasn't been great. But now I'm getting into it. Right, that's the Sword and Shield. Looks like they've seen better days. Nothing that a bit of polish and some elbow grease can't sort out. See that, Stumpy? The sword and shield. The legends were really true. You obtained a rusted sword. God, it's like playing Legend of Zelda. It is said that the hero used the sword uh, to halt a terrible disaster in ancient times, but it's grown rusty and worn. That settles it. I'm taking the shield. Oh, wow, would you look at the state of this thing? It seems like it might fall into pieces if you so much as look at it funny. I don't know if these rusty old things will really be able to stop the darkest day, but, well, I guess it can't hurt to have them along. Let's hope they bring us some good luck. Have you seen Frozen 2? asked the flame. I have. I saw it last night in IMAX, and it is epic. 9 out of 10. Maybe the Pokemon themselves really are still asleep somewhere. So it seems we're on our own. If we want to go to help Lee, uh, this is all the help we've got. So I guess that if I was playing the shield game, I um I would have picked up the shield rather than the, the sword, I would assume. All right, let's make my way out. Let's go like right on my way out here. So it's the other way. Oh, who's this in the water down here? This might be a good Pokemon. Actually, no, because I don't want any more water Pokemon anyway. Oh, I can't even go right down that way. Anything good over here? Ooh. Ah. Go this way. Uh, there's a TM somewhere around here. Or is there? Oh, is this it? Ah, Phantom Force. Sounds like a ghost type as well. Should we be able to use this? Uh, Copper might be able to, to use this. Nice, 90 power. So, what does it do? Try something on the next turn. Ah, oh, so it's kind of like dig or dive. I mean, that's quite good, but I can use potions and stuff to do that. And I've only got one dart, then I've got Shadow Ball, which is 80 power. I could just replace. You know what? I'm hardly ever going to use this. I'm going to keep this. Just go all out on the ghost moves.
Butterfree! Use the graphs. Ah, my Chilters is back! <laughs> no spoilers for Frozen 2 for those who haven't seen it. Yeah, please! Just don't spoil anything in the chat. Don't spoil any games or movies. <laughs> But yeah, I would say that if you're like on the fence about seeing Frozen 2, I'd say definitely see it. And I'd say definitely see it in the cinema. Like it's a great cinema film. It's like, I won't spoil anything. Like I think overall the story probably isn't quite as strong as the first one. And maybe the songs too aren't quite up there. But like, I think it like just the, the style of it and some of the some specific moments that just look incredible. And it's like, I say it's probably more emotional than the, the first one. So yeah, I won't say any more than that for those that don't want to know anything. But yeah, and it's really funny as well. Probably slightly funnier than the first one. In my opinion. It's all it's all subjective. Everyone can have their own opinion. Some of you might hate of you. Just hate it. Some might like love it. Look at this. Like, I love this wheezing. <laughs> yeah. I don't want it. I don't want to use it. But I just love the, uh, the style of it. I haven't actually tried capturing a Pokemon in ages, have I? I kind of forgot about capturing Pokemon. Just haven't bothered doing it in so long. Story is better, but songs are bad, says Adam. Like, I think overall, the first game songs... The, the first game, the first film songs are better. But, um... Like, I don't think you can say they're bad. No, they're, they're not bad. They're good. Like, you might not like them. Yeah, like you can say I don't, you can say I prefer the songs in the first one, but I think you can say the second ones are bad. They're good. Just maybe not quite as memorable. It's always hard to judge though, because like, how many times have you heard Let It Go? Like it's, it's played so much, it's like imprinted in all of our brains. It makes it very hard to compare with something new. Like people always prefer the old stuff, you know? Because that's what you have nostalgia to, and you've just heard it more. You get like, you build like an affection to it. It's like one of the things I face with like YouTube is like everyone always wants the old stuff. And like when you do something new, it's very hard to get people to like give it a fair chance. You know, same with like bands, like they always want, oh, play your classic songs, you know, like they release a new album and they'll be on tour. And they'll be like, yeah, we wrote these new songs. And they're like, play your hits. <laughs> and it's like, <laughs> so it's kind of a bit like that with movies as well. Right, let's, uh, let's head out of the woods. I was trying to just run into some of the random Pokemon. Ooh, hello, hello. In case I ran into some fire Pokemon. Well, I, don't think, uh, I don't think we're finding any fire Pokemon in here. Doing a little bit of bonus leveling up is never going to hurt, though. It's only going to make things easier. To be fair, though, I am getting, like... Most of my Pokemon were around, like, level 50. When I thought I was going in to do these fighting. But I've done so many battles today. That I've leveled up so much. I think that... Oh, where are they gone? <laughs> uh, I think that, um... Like, now, by the time I fight Leon, like, I'm, I'm gonna be close to the level of his Pokemon. Yeah, please don't spoil it. If, uh, if anyone spoils, uh, feel free to... to either delete their comments. If they're, like, doing it, obviously, intentionally, you can, like, remove all of their, their comments so they can't comment anymore. I'm pretty strict with spoilers because I hate getting anything spoiled. Like, it was quite good for me, like, seeing Frozen. Or like most films, is that like I hadn't seen, like I'd barely even seen any screenshots from it. I hadn't seen any trailers for it at all. Because when I know I'm going to see a film, like I just don't want to see any trailers from it. Like any like Pixar film, I know I'm going to see it in the cinema because I love Pixar. So like I'll ne I won't watch any trailers. I just want to go in completely blind. And like, because most people consider spoilers as in like, this character dies or this happens, you know. Like I don't want to see any of like the settings for where they go. I don't want to hear any of the jokes. Like, I don't want to know anything about it. Like, I just want to go in completely blind. And that was a really good thing to, to do for, for this.
But I'm like that with everything, like games, whatever. Like I, I only the only time I watch trailers is if I have no idea what it is. I'm trying to like work out if I want to see it. But if there's like a certain like um, film studio or a certain like game developer, like I know that like for certain like game developers, like no matter what, I'm gonna play like every game they release. <laughs> so I just, why watch the trailer if you're gonna see it anyway? We've gone like really off topic here, haven't we? I've been in this woods forever. All right, wheelie worm, you can, you can go out for a bit. Yeah, so I'm getting to like the high 50s. Some of my Pokemon are around 60, but we're uh, we're definitely getting there. And we probably, uh, I reckon we have um a few more battles before we eventually go against Lee. And I reckon we're going to have to fight some of Rose's goons or something as well. Uh, when were your next battle, Squid? I don't know. Uh, if you weren't here earlier, like three hours earlier, uh, I did battle Squid in this stream at the very beginning. And I won't spoil the outcome of the... um of the victory, but let's just say me and my partner are a, <laughs> a formidable, <laughs> formidable foe. <laughs> yeah, if you want to go and watch that, you can just watch back on, uh, on VOD. Uh, when will the stream end? Uh, I, I'm going to see what happens when I get out of this woods. Then maybe do like one battle uh, against uh, a viewer, then I'll probably end it there. Then I'll go and uh, chill out for the rest of the evening. Uh, block the word Frozen 2 if you can. I think you might be able to, to do that. I'm not sure. I think mods can do that. If you're like super sensitive and really want to be super careful not to get it spoiled, just like turn the chat off. Just don't, don't look at the chat if you're like really nervous. You don't want to take any chances. But it's also a good way to see, like, for those that are spoiling it, so we can ban them. <laughs> so we can just get get rid of them. <laughs> Might not be the worst. Uh, what do you do to chill out? Play video games. <laughs> I'm a nerd through and through. Either play with my pets or play video games. Or, like, watch something. But yeah, I play a lot of games. Right then, I think this might be a, a good time to like end for the, the story. Because I think we're about to like start something big coming up next. So I thought this was going to be the uh, the end of the game. But then there was this whole big darkest day twist that I didn't see coming. So, uh, yeah, I'll do another stream at some point during the, the week. And we'll probably uh, finish it off then. But before we go, I want to do one battle. One battle against someone in the, the chat. So if you have either Sword or Shield on the, the Switch... And you want to battle me, and you haven't battled me before, uh, then uh, yeah, let's do it. Let's fight. So link battle. Oh, I need to go on the internet, don't I? Oh, we're on the internet already. Right, link battle. So you just got to type in the same code and do a single battle. And yeah, we'll see whether we can end on a high, end on a, a victory. So just do six five four seven. I repeat, six five four seven is the code. And then yeah, single battle. We're going to have a go. And if you don't end up going against me, you will end up um, battling against someone else who's also watching the stream. So if you don't match up against me, don't panic. Just carry on battling out of the person you're battling. Don't uh, don't back out. And I'm going up against uh, Makoto. All right. 1v1. Bring it on. Makoto is representing the chat. Makoto, Makoto is your leader. We need some hashtag Team Makotos in the, the chat. You need to support them. If Makoto wins, you win. They are your representative. It's me against all of you. Uh, use your, uh, your full party, Makoto, all six.
I will be using my graph, just to let you all know. Just so that's on the table. Gra graphs are allowed in the rules here. No, it's not cheating for me to use my graph. <laughs> right. Stampy against Makoto. They're on a Pokemon sword as well. Bring it on. Let's do it. It's an exciting way to win. I love doing these battles. Like, it's fun doing the AI battles, but they're always a little bit... They make weird choices. It's so much more fun to battle against real people. And what is that? What is living in its head? It's got tiny lizards in its head. What is this thing? What are they? Are they like separate, also living Pokemon? What are those things? <laughs> Makoto might be in trouble against Graf. Watch out. He has a Graf. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone get back. I got a graph and I'm not afraid to use it. <laughs> I mean, it said super effective. It didn't do much damage. Oh, no. Oh, we're both super effective. Should I try freeze dry? I have a chance to, to actually freeze them, which would be really strong. Oh, no, 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 no. <gasps> One health. One health. Half a heart. Half a heart. Team up. Team up. Team up. Ooh, we're both so weak. I wasn't able to, to freeze them, though. <laughs> what does Miracote do? Counters any... Let's try this. Let's try Miracote. I think it's going to finish me off before I can use it, though. Yeah, no chance. We are all against Stampy. Yeah, you're on Makoto side. Don't, don't team for me. If I win, you lose. Uh... Send out Cupper. Why not? Always fear a Stampy with a Graph. <laughs> I love these Graph. I do need to get like a Graph emote made or something. It'd be so funny. Oh, wow. They're all like super effective. Uh, what's like the most chance to hit? Uh, let's just do this one. Hopefully I have... Oh, no. Oh, they're, they're high speaks. They're always attacking fast. Oh, what are they doing? Oh, they're vanished. That's annoying. This is going to do loads of damage. It is, isn't it? No! They're so weak! Oh, they're so, so weak. I just had to get one little hit on them. You sucker punch. It didn't matter what... It didn't matter what move I used. I didn't even get a chance to hit them. Their speed's too high. Hopefully my speed's going to be higher. Are they going to switch out? Oh, no, no. They're still attacking first. <laughs> they sent out their little head lizards. <laughs> oh, no. Both of them. Oh, oh, they're back, though. God, what, po what weird strong Pokemon is this? They're destroying me. Makoto is crushing you. Hey, still got my secret weapon. Still got my graph. Uh, this is the uh, the sword version, Mafu. Oh, it's a legendary Pokemon. Uh, okay, that's why. <laughs> I don't I don't feel bad. <laughs> they've got they've obviously finished the game. They they got some legendary Pokemon. I I know what uh, I'm getting myself into when I do these uh, battles against random people. Cool to see a legendary Pokemon though. Oh, se semi-legendary. Oh, are they switching out? Is there going to be a grass type? Oh! It's <laughs> Spoilers! Okay, this, uh, this ain't going to go very well for me, is it? I don't even know what type that is. Whatever it is, it's not, it's not weak against water, that's for sure. I don't even know anything that's like more effective against it, though. I mean, I could just like, I could just like Dynamax. <laughs> Why not? Why is it, like, they're just going to crush me anyway. Let, let's at least get a Dynamax in. Graph used paper cut. <laughs> the Graph champion, Makoto. The Graph's undefeatable. 
<laughs> oh dear. God, they even did like loads of damage against me while I was Dynamaxed. At least I did some good damage against them. Probably going to get destroyed now, though. What is that? What is that move? It's not allowed. <laughs> Look at this graph. Look at this graph, isn't it neat? Wouldn't you say my table's complete? Wouldn't you say this graph has all the statistics that you need? <laughs> <laughs> graph used ripped. <laughs> There we go. At least I at least I took out two legendary Pokemon. I'll take that. <laughs> Looks like Makito's got this. I could show you my graph. <laughs> <laughs> what other Disney songs can we just add a graph into? A whole new graph! <laughs> High quality singing. Yeah, I'm not a singer. Come on, we need we need some more some more Disney songs but with graph thrown in there. I can't think of any more. I just do like blank. This graft is a giraffe now. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. They got like the sword and the shield one. I had no chance in this fight, did I? I have bar graphs and pie charts are plenty. I have templates and spreadsheets galore. <laughs> Let it graph, let it graph, <laughs> the circle of graph. <laughs> You're doing under the graph, under the graph. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I can even use Wild Charge, it would kill me. <laughs> a jingle graph, a jingle graph. <laughs> Bibbidi boobity graph. <laughs> Super Supercatcher fragilistic espiala graph is. <laughs> <laughs> I wanna be a mighty graph like no graph's been before. I'm writing down my statistics. I'm working on my bar. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's take their their bar graph. Can we have some GGs in the the chat for Makito for their epic battle? The uh, the better player absolutely won there. I had zero chance of all of their legendaries. Well done though. Well done capturing uh, all of them. And uh, defeating me uh, so well. Uh, I had healed up my Pokemon, hadn't I? All right, let's uh, end the, the stream with one one final cheeky save. Uh, so yeah, I thought this was going to be the um, 
the the final stream of the the game. Uh, but yeah, there was a lot more to the the game than I expected. So uh, for those that have finished it, like. How long would you guess I have left? Do you reckon we'll get it all finished off in one final stream? I probably wouldn't... My next stream probably won't be this long. This was like an especially long stream. Just because I was having fun. <laughs> just because just because you guys were all making me laugh. I just wanted to carry on. <laughs> yeah, like, to anyone who's finished the game, no spoilers. But, like, roughly... How long do you think uh, we got left? Two more streams? Ten years? <laughs> Uh, there's also, po yeah, I'm not worried, like, post-story, that will be a separate thing. Oh, 30 minutes, oh, two streams. Uh, one stream, two at max. Okay, so, yeah, there'll probably be one or two more streams uh, during the, the week, depending on how long it takes to, to go through. So, uh, yeah, if you want to carry on with my Pokemon journey and keep on helping me out and having fun, uh, then, yeah, that will be coming up uh, later on in the week. And then I'll probably do one more final stream after we complete the game where I do just some battles and maybe get some shinies and just kind of see what else there is in the Gala region uh, that I can go and uh, have some fun with. But yeah, thank you so much uh, for sticking with the, the stream for so long. Uh, to all of you uh, that are just joining the stream, uh, bad luck <laughs> because the stream has ended. But uh, you can go and uh, rewind and uh, watch it back on VOD if you want to see why we're singing Disney songs with graph <laughs> in the name. And if you're confused, you can find out why we're doing that. But for now, I want to thank you all very much for watching and I'll see you all next week. Bye.